Okay, well, is everybody ready for that kind of stuff, or what? Alright, guys, well, today we're going to be playing Minecraft. Hello everyone, it's me, Mr. Blue. Well, it looks like we're playing a game of Minecraft right now. Well, I guess it's time well, I guess it's time to go see what everybody is up to. Alright. Well, looks like I got somebody to thank already. Well, I want to thank the, the guy that is looking like a ghost in the YouTube chat for five membership. Well, thank you so much for that. Well, look, it is me, Mr. Blue, and looks like Luke and Big, Luke and Big Pants have left me some items in my inventory. Well, that's just awesome. Hello, it's me, Mr. Blue. Mr. Blue, you're... You don't, you don't have the right mic. Alright, that's a very song. Hello, it's me, Mr. Blue. Okay, yeah, now we're on oh, the track. Okay. I, don't, I don't have any cookies. Please don't, please don't kill me. Please don't kill me. Please don't kill me. I have too much stuff on me. Okay, I will get you the cookies. I will get you the cookies. Well, it is, it is looking like this guy is needing a cookie right about time. now. Well, I guess I'm going to keep... I'm going to move on. Well, I wonder what's happening in the downtown area of the town. Like, what is happening downtown? Well, looking like something is happening right over here. Well, that is an interesting story. Oh look, it is an advertisement for my Mr. Blue business. Well, that's just awesome. Oh. Well, looking like a criminal is on the loose. Better get that guy, huh? Hmm. Well, okay. Well, if you want to send Mr. Blue a mail, you can always do that and I will answer as much wisdom as I can. Well, it is only a $5 postcard to send me to get some of my mail, so... Hello, I'm Mr. Blue. Well, it's nice to meet you as well. Well, okay, if you think so, but, well, I guess that's just up to you then, I guess. Well, whatever you say, Randall. Yes. Well, you have a great day as well. Mr. Blue, hey! Hello, it's me, Mr. Blue. 
I can see that. How are you, Mr. Blue? Well, I'm just doing fantastic. Well, I just got back from vacation, and well, now I'm gonna play a little bit of a little bit of Minecraft and trying to get my okay. all my wisdom out there and stuff. Okay. All right. Have fun. Well, thank you so much. Remember, no loitering on my company property. Well, okay. Careful talking to him. Just saying. He seemed like a chill guy, low key. Mm. Maybe once you get to know him. Hey, I'm Mr. Blue. What's your name? Hey, I'm Mr. Blue. What's your name? Well, I, I guess this guy's not wanting to talk to me right now, but that's low-key chill. Mr. Blue's wisdom. His wisdom for only one dollar. Well, this is my business. And, well, I'm going to try to getting some people in here. <clears throat> well, maybe I'm going to talk to them a little bit and giving them my wisdom. Well, I thought I'm seeing something, but I guess not. Well, the people in the chat are telling me that I can click the tree and he will talk to me and, and I have to gain this trust to talking to him a lot. Okay, well, I guess I'm going to go and try that. Hello, I'm Mr. Blue. Hi, I'm Mr. Blue. Well, this is just an excellent picture. Well, I'm super happy you're giving that to me as well. Yeah. I'm wondering what made you go blue. Hi, I'm Mr. Blue. Well, this guy sure has a lot of wisdom. Might might be a competitor to, a competitor to my business. Oh, looking like he is pretty angry with me. Very interesting. Very interesting stuff, Mr. Mr. Blue. Well, if you don't mind, I'm trying to have a conversation with this Mr. Tree. Oh, uh, I couldn't tell. <laughs> Hi, I'm Mr. Blue.
Well, this is definitely an interesting guy. That was not fun. I agree. Let's stop this. You started it. I'm gonna get my. I'm gonna get my frame. Oh fuck! Sorry. Hey man, relax. That was a, a accident. Oh well. Well, that just sullied the whole experience, I think. Time to find something else to do. Hi, I'm Mr. Blue. Are you looking to get some wisdom from Mr. Blue's wisdom? I... I just wanted to rest on the Mr. Blue wisdom shack. Well, it is a pretty restful place, is it not? Well, it's designed to be a restful, just chill, restful place to be. It's very nice. Well, thank you. Well, if ever you need any wisdom, please let me know. I'll be here to help give you all my wisdom. I will let you know. Oh, hell yeah. This is a sweet spot. This is the sweetest spot ever. Holy shit. Well, you guys, I'm trying to maybe... Doing some work around the server, maybe, because, well, my, I'm going to be honest, my wisdom shop is not getting too many people interested in my wisdom. So maybe if I, maybe, maybe somebody can take in a screenshot right now of the stream and of my beautiful head, and maybe they can, making a, a poster, a poster for, uh, for me that I can be using for advertising for my handyman services. And maybe, maybe making a little poster, like a little flyer for Mr. Blue and putting it on the Discord. And and then I will posting a post it around post it around and all that kind of stuff and maybe get a maybe get some advertising for my business. Well, what do you think about that? Can we make you guys can make some Mr. Blue propaganda? Maybe some maybe some Mr. Blue maybe some Mr. Blue uh, some Mr. Blue stuff in the server. That'd be really nice. Well, time to read the messages I got. Well, this message is from Mr. Blue Fan Thirty Two. Well, thank you for the postcard. Let me read it. Wow. I cannot believe Mr. Blue is back. I am being so happy right about now. <laughs> Hooray! Well, thank you so much, Mr. Blue fan. And, well, I'm really happy to be back. And, well, I'm having a really fun time as well, so. Well, it's just a great time. Well, the next message is from Kato the Husky. Well, time to give him a reading from that. Well, hello from Greenland. Hope you're having a great day, Mr. Blue. I have only just discovered you, but I am loving your streams. Please keep up the great content. Well, thank you so much. Well, I'm really enjoying this, and I really think that this is a nice thing to be saying to me right now, and I'm really glad that you're all saying this to me right now as well. Well, let me tell you right now, there's a lot of Mr. Blue content out there, and, well, I should definitely think that you should be watching Mr. Blue's Wisdom 1 and also Mr. Blue's Wisdom 2 featuring Mr. Orange. Well, that will keep you up to date on the lore of Mr. Blue. Well, thank you so much for your postcard. Well, wasn't that just a nice time? Well, really nice. Well, I gotta get some diamonds, I think, so I can walk around and be a rich guy. Well, that's not a great look. Well, Mr. Blue is just feeling awesome right now, you guy. 
Well, if you want to come to the... Well, if you guys want to do a little thing and maybe coming to the, the Discord, if you do an exclamation mark Discord in the Twitch chat, oh, well, you can totally do that right now. And I want to thank the mysterious guy, the mysterious ghost from YouTube, who's giving another 20 memberships. Well, thank you so much for that. Well, that is just such a nice gesture on YouTube that you're doing. And Oluski on YouTube is asking, Luca, how do you make the video? Well, my name is not Luca. My name is Mr. Blue. So you're going to have to ask somebody, Luca, for that. Well... Maybe if you go on his VOD channel, you will find the VOD name tutorial. That will teach you a thing or two. But thank you for the two US dollars. Well, thank you so much. Well, thank you again, the Mysterious Ghost, for the 20, now 25 total memberships donated for the stream. I really am appreciating that. Well, looks like we got some new mail. Well, this postcard is brought to us by Phaedrus. Well, they're asking, you can feel me, but you cannot touch me. I am music to the ears of some I am the sky, I am the sea, and the light scatters less, and my light scatters less than none. Well, I don't know if that is a kind of a riddle or something that you're wanting me to solve, but I don't really know what's going on right now. But okay, well that is pretty cool. Huh. Well, alright. Well, thank you so much for the postcard. Well, it looks like there's a big car here about to kid kill this old man. Well, that's pretty crazy, I think. Well, all right. Whoa. Well, that is just a great photography. Well, thank you so much. Can I keeping this? Well, okay, well, thank you so much. Well, hey, I, my name is Mr. Blue. Cookie. No, my name is Mr. Blue. <clears throat> no, my name is Mr. Blue. Cookie. Well, nice to meet you, Cookie. My name is Mr. Blue. Well, maybe, perhaps if you use your words, perhaps if you use your words, maybe I can help you out. Cookie. Well, look, I got a cookie for you, buddy. Well, do you want that? Real what a well, that's really good. Well, maybe, here's my advice to you. Maybe if you're going to the cookie store, you can get some cookie. You ever thinking about that? Well, maybe if you go to the store that's selling some cookies, you can get some cookies. Well, what about that for you, huh? Well, that was pretty crazy. Well, look at that lovely little house over there. I think I'm going to go and check that out.
Well, what a nice house. Well, what a pretty little house with a nice little blue roof and also a nice little blue bed. Well, I wonder what kind of wood this is. It's really nice. Well, that is a jacaranda log. Well, that's awesome. Well, I'm really liking this big house and what is in the chest and all that? It's William Worm! Well, that is a William Worm, my friend William Worm from... Well, that is my friend William Worm from, from the Mr. Blue and Mr. Orange show. What is he doing in this chest? Well, I gotta take him and free him from this chest. Alright, well, now that I've freed William Worm, we can go back to making the Mr. Blue and Mr. Orange and also the co-hosted by William Worm show. Well, hello, William Worm. Welcome back to the Mr. Blue Show. Well, what's going on with you today, huh? Well, that's just so good to hear, Mr. William Worm. Well, William, well, Mr. Worm, would you like to go on an adventure? Hi, I'm Mr. Blue. Well, it looks like that guy's muted, I think. The muted the muted pumpkin. Well, I'm gonna look for an anvil now because well I gotta using my anvil and stuff. Get an anvil maybe. Hello there, I'm Mr. Blue. Well, perhaps there's an anvil in here I can use. Well, look at that, an anvil. It is William Worm. My co-host, William Worm, from the Mr. Blue and Mr. Orange show. Well, William Worm, what kind of stuff do you want to get up to today, huh? Well, we can do all sorts of fun little thing and maybe talking to people and maybe getting... Maybe getting, uh... Maybe getting, making a friend or something. Well, what do you, what do you say, uh, William Worm? What do you say about that, huh? Well, I couldn't agree more, William Worm. I couldn't agree more. Well, let's go and do that, huh? What's that, William Worm? What are you talking about, Mr. William Worm? Well, I guess that could be a fun idea as well. Well, all right. William Worm, I missed you so much. Well, I'm so happy that you're back. I'm so happy that you're back among us. Uh, Mr. William Worm, I'm so I'm gonna have, be a great time with you today. Well, that's just awesome. Well, okay, Mr. William Worm. Well, let me pick you up really quick and well, let's go on a little adventure. Okay, yeah, let's do that. Well, what if we stop at the Family Mart? Well, what do you think about that, William Worm? Do you think that's a fun, awesome time? Well, this place is pretty empty. Maybe we should go maybe we should go somewhere else.
William Worm, would you like to watch something maybe? Well, William Worm, it's the Mr. Blue, it is the Mr. Blue Show. Well, I guess it's time for you and me to sit down and, and enjoy the show. Well, holy crap, can you guys believe in this right now? That is just a, that's just crazy. Wow. William Worm, are you believing this right now? Well, this is just awesome. Well, this is just so great. Well, it is taking quite a long time to load. Don't you agree, Mr. William Worm? Well, I think that we ought to maybe... Well, I think that we ought to maybe... Skip it forward, maybe. I don't know. If that is even a possible thing that you can do. Well, it doesn't look like it. Well, maybe... Well, maybe we cannot do that, but well, let's tr let's try something else real quick, okay? Well, that did not work. Well, that is just too bad. Well, well, I guess let's go somewhere else, William Worm. What's up, Mr. Blue? Hey, I'm Mr. Blue, and this is my my friend and co-host, William Worm. William Say hi Worm. to William Worm. Hi, William Worm. Can I eat him or something? No. No, if you do that, I'd have to kill you. Alright, you want him back, or...? Yes. Well, thanks so much, and it's really great to meeting you. All right, until next time. Are you hearing that noise as well? I did hear that noise. Well, that was pretty scary. Yeah, it was. I thought it was you. Well, I'm Mr. Blue and I can't make a noise like that, but it was great to meet you and I guess I'll see you later. Okay, sounds good. Well, that was pretty crazy. I'm just Mr. Blue. Guys, I have a really good idea for you guys. Why don't you guys go on... Well, why don't you guys are uh, taking a picture of uh, Mr. Blue and making some propaganda pictures so that Mr. Blue can go on and putting his propaganda all over the server? Wouldn't that be a fun time? Well, I'll take a screenshot now and maybe making a propaganda photo for Mr. Blue, Mr. Blue's business, and putting on the, put on the Discord exclamation mark Discord. Well, thanks.
Well, perhaps we're going to enter uh, our good buddy Mr. Luca Big Pants' home. Maybe to find a camera or something. Well, that is a pretty scary sound that is happening in the Minecraft right now. I can't, don't know what is going on, quite frankly. Well, we're gonna make some stuff like that. Now, where's the camera? Where's the camera that we were trying to be using for this kind of thing thing right now, huh? Well, I found it. Well, well, it was looking like we were going to need to get some paper as well. I'm seeing some really nice pictures of Mr. Blue Propaganda in the Discord, in the Discord, exclamation mark Discord. Well, I might be using some of these for, well, I might be using some of these for our, for our propaganda. Well, wait a minute, guys. Hold on a second now. Just wait a minute, guys. I've got a really good idea. Why don't we make a little bit of a poster in our house? Whoops. Well, that is too big. Well, that is looking really good. And what if we go into the Discord... and go into the art gallery and maybe well thank you so much wiggle my worm for the giving out the one community gift sub well thank you so much well what if I'm taking out my camera and I'm doing a little bit of this Whoa. Holy crap. Is that a Mr. Blue art? Well, that is just crazy. I'm looking all crazy and stuff. Well, thank you so much to the person who is doing this right now. Name, the name of, name of Teeter the Hoon. Well, thank you so much for this art. Well, this is Mr. Blue. Well, perhaps we have more Mr. Blue fan art that we can put up on the thing. Well, maybe we have some more Mr. Blue fan art. Let's go and check, take a look. Well, it looks like we got some more art in the in the Discord, in the art, in the Discord gallery, and also some other stuff. Maybe that you guys are making. Well, look at that as a picture of Mr. Blue and Mr. Orange. Well, isn't that just a great... Well, isn't that just a great thing that is happening right now? Well, that is just crazy. Well, what if there's any more... If there's any more Mr. Blue... Uh, Mr. Blue propaganda... 
Man, maybe some Mr. Blue stuff, Mr. Blue Wisdom that is going on. Well, looks like we got another. Looks like we got another art going on. Well, I guess let's put that up here. Well, look at this, Mr. Blue and Mr. Orange, and also William Worm, like we are having in our hand right here. It is William Worm, classic character in the Mr. Blue show, William Worm. Well, thank you so much for all of the art, you guys. Well, this is just a fantastic time. Well. Well, it looks like we got some Mr. Blue. Well, it looks like we got some some Mr. Blue questions, some Mr. Blue propaganda, and some Mr. Blue advertisements. Maybe that we're getting on the Discord exclamation mark Discord. And I'm gonna saving a couple of them right now. Well, maybe let's go and well, let's go and find some business to having maybe doing some business and stuff. Well, actually, Mr. Blue is going to be right back. Mr. Blue is going to be right back and taking a short break. Okay, Mr. Blue is going to be taking a short break right now. Okay. Well, I'll be right back, okay, everybody. Nobody, and nobody freak out or anything. Well, in the meantime, while I am going to be gone, why don't we take a look? Well, why don't we take a look at a little bit of a... Taking a look at a little bit of a Mr. Blue, the Mr. Blue show. While I'm gone, you guys stay, can stay entertained. Okay, well, I'll be right back. Hello everybody, welcome back to the Mr. Blue Show. Well, <laughs> it's been a long time that we've not been talking, so I can't wait to answer all of the questions that you guys might have for me as well. <laughs> well, hello everybody in the chat as well. Hi, ever well, hello everyone, how is everybody, how is everybody doing today? Well, I'm quite good, I'm quite fantastic, I'm very happy to be back with the Mr. Blue Show. And, well, I want to start off really quickly by saying I am so very sorry to everybody that the stream has started a, an hour late. We had a little bit of a, well, you can call it like a security risk earlier, but, well, now it's okay. So, I want to tell everybody what we're going to be doing today now. Okay, <laughs> well, today I'm going to be answering all of your questions that you might have to ask for me. And I'm going to try to give you as much of my wisdom as I can. Well, <laughs> I'm Mr. Blue. Now, before we begin, I'd like to let say I would like to set down the ground rules. Well, to giving a to, to asking a question, you got to give a five you got to give a two dollar super chat or a two hundred bit donation on Twitch or five two dollar super chat on YouTube. And my producer is gonna put a little thing up on here with two dollars. There we go. 
Well, look at that. Doesn't that look really great? Well, this is the price that it is costing to ask me a question. And, well, I'm going to tell you right now, the last time we did this, well, the last time we were doing this stream, well, the question got in really fast, and we had to changing it really quickly to $5. So get your questions in now when, when you still can. So, all right. Well, it looks like we're, let's get on with it without further ado and get to the first uh, freaking question. Uh, all right. Producer, you have to click on the you have to click on the but on the on the slideshow to change it. There we go. Very nice. <laughs> that is awesome. Well, our first question of the day comes from Schmiegel from Germany. Schmiegel asks, "How do you know that you are free?" Well, Schmiegel, this is just an absolutely awesome question, and I can't wait to answer this question for you. Well, first things first, let me tell you right now, is when well, I open the door, my everybody, I'm going to pause that right now because, well, we're back and we're going to play a little bit more Minecraft. But before we're doing any of that, i got to tell you guys right now, if you do a LucaBigPants.com, you can find the Mr. Blue shirt. Are you freaking kidding me? That is the Mr. Blue shirt at, at LucaBigPants.com. Wait, let's take a look at this really quick. Whoa. Okay, that is crazy. Well, that is a great shirt about Mr. Blue's wisdom and Mr. Blue's advice. And, well, Luca Big Pants is graciously hosting the, the merchandise, my merchandise, on his website. Well, that is crazy. Mr. Blue's wisdom vintage tea for only a $35. And also a Mr. Blue wisdom vintage crew neck for only a $55. Well, that is crazy. And, well, this is a really good product, and I hope that you are liking it a lot. Well, okay. It's time for to getting to get back to the game of Minecraft that we're playing. Well, thank you to, thank you to the viewer who has submitted this image of a Mr. Blue saying I'm blue are you? Well, if you want to submit some pictures, put please put them in the art gallery, uh, and and letting me let me know what is going on, and putting them all in the, in the art gallery and the picture gallery, and please let me know what you guys are thinking about all that kind of stuff. All right, well, we got another one as well. We're gonna be getting it right now. Well, that is a pretty crazy picture. Well, I'm going to put these up somewhere and doing some stuff as well. Perhaps right here is a good place to putting the first one. Well, that looks pretty good. I'm blue, are you? Well, I'm very blue. Isn't that right, William Worm? What do you think about this? Doesn't that looking really good, William Warm? You liking the kind of thing that we're doing right now? Well, that is just a great news. Okay. Well, perhaps the next place we're going to put in a, maybe a Mr. Blue propaganda. Maybe somewhere around here where there's a heavy traffic amount of people that's walking around. Well, I guess let's find out. Hmm. Well, perhaps near the arena where there is an arena and stuff. Well, I don't know about that. Well, I'm not sure about all that.
Well, here's another picture maybe made by some other guy. Well, that is pretty good. I like that. Well, time for another one maybe. Perhaps in the subway station. Well, it looks like it is too cluttered in here. Hello, I'm Mr. Blue. Oh, it looks well, it is looking like he is sleeping, so I guess we're going to leave him alone right now. Well, what do you think we should do, William Worm? Well, do you think that we should maybe do a little bit of a talking to the tree guy, or... Well, maybe we do a little walking around. Well, what do you think, William, William Worm? Well, alright, okay. Well, I guess let's go and walk around. Hello, I'm Mr. Blue. Hi, Mr. Blue. Well, I want you to meet my good friend, William Worm. Who is this? My good friend, William Worm. Oh, William Worm. Well, say hi is to William like... Worm. Hello, William Worm. Could I, like... Okay, this is interesting. Thank you. Well, of Thank course. You for showing my... me this. Well, of course, my pleasure. There's a fucking... Hang on. Well, if you guys want to send me some wisdom, or maybe ask me, or ask me a question and get my wisdom, well, please let Sorry, me I'm know. Sorry, I'm trying to bring my cat home. Uh. Hi, I'm Mr. Blue. Hello, I'm Mr. Blue. Well, hi there, I'm Mr. Blue. Well, it looks like he is opening his eyes and maybe we can have a conversation. Well, that's pretty funny. Well, I don't know what this guy is saying, but he surely looks like he's got a lot of wisdom, and maybe this is where I'm getting the source of my wisdom now, from now on? Well, this is a really cool guy. Well, he's making a poem right now. Look at that. That is pretty cool. Well, I sure like that a lot. What about another wisdom, please, Mr. Tree? Sunlight is delicious. A wood go for a swim. I forgot my swimming trunks. Huh. I met a bee today. She told me... Well, he's speaking a little too fast for me, but that is okay. Well, maybe we go and try to make some friends now. Isn't that right, William Worm? Well, this is looking really, really nice. Well, maybe we should putting on our putting on our armor to go a little faster under the water. Oops.
Well, I'm hearing about Josh is making maybe a, a cathedral over there, maybe, or something like that. Well, this is just great. Well, look at that in the distance, it's looking really nice. Well, look at that, it's a lovely church, and looks like Josh is doing a little bit of the building himself over there. Well, let's go and tell him how good this really is looking. Well, what a beautiful, what a beautiful looking building and a beautiful looking spire. Well, this is quite a good build. Well, let me let me go and say hi. Hello, I'm Mr. Blue. Yeah. What's up, Mr. Blue? Well, I was just taking a little walk around, and I was thinking that maybe I should come and see this beautiful big. Well, it looked like a big cathedral that you're building, and I think that this is really just a nice building that you're making. So, I just want to come and look, take a look at it, and well, maybe say hi. It's me, Mr. Blue. Hi. Hi, Mr. Blue. Well, hi, nice to meet you. Well, I'm. Well, this is quite a nice building you're making. I didn't want that anymore. Well, I don't want this either. This is my good friend and co-host, Mr. Uh, William Worm. Say hi to co-host for what? Well, co-host for the Mr. For Blue, what? the Mr. Blue and Mr. Orange show, featuring Mr. Am William I on air Warren. right now? Who's Mr. Orange? Well, Mr. Orange is my co-host for the Mr. Blue and Mr. Orange show. No, I well. thought he's, William Worm or whatever was. Well, he's also co my co-host as well, I guess. Well, where's Mr. Orange? He's on vacation in Cancun. I've never seen Mr. Orange. I don't know how true this is. Well, he doesn't really like the game of Minecraft too much, but but I'm definitely loving the game of Minecraft a lot. Wow. That's nice. That actually yeah. made me feel really warm inside when you said, I'm glad you're enjoying yourself here on Minecraft. Well, I'm, I'm having a great time, and I'm really liking the building that you were making as well. Well, well, 
Well, this is pretty cool and pretty nice. Well, this is going to be a Catholic church, I'm guessing, as well. A Catholic cathedral or maybe a bas basilica or something like that. Catholic. Yeah, sure, sure, sure. Well, not that it really matters. I am a guy that is following my own religion. And that religion is be blue and be chill low-key. All right. Sounds chill. I'm Mr. Blue. Yeah. I've heard. Well, that's just great news that the word is getting around about Mr. Blue. Well, if you're ever needing any wisdom from Mr. Blue, well, I got a little shop in the, well, in the main town called Mr. Blue's Wisdom. Well, please stop by any time, and if you have any problem or anything, I can give you a wisdom. Well, I'll give you a wisdom right now if you want. Sorry? Well, I'm a guy who's just chill and I'm like giving wisdom to people. If you want, I can give you a little bit of advice. A little bit of Mr. Blue advice right now, free of charge. No, thank you. Well, I guess I have to respect that wish, even though I love to give advice to people and stuff like that. Well, I guess that's too bad. You know what? Go ahead. Follow your passion. Wow. That's profound. Well, thanks. Well, William Moore, where would you like to go now? Okay. Well, I'm glad we could have another satisfied customer and stuff like that. Time to go back to the mainland, maybe, and see if we can make some new friends as well. Well, I got a really great idea now. Don't mind me just farting my way around town. Well, I'm looking for some wisdom on the Discord right now. And I'm seeing one that I really like. Look at that. Well, that is just great. Well, that's just fantastic. That's definitely a good wisdom that we got right there.
Well, it looks like this is a tree that is in the way, so I'm going to be cutting it right now. Well, it looks like both these trees are in the way for sure. Unless that is on purpose. Well, I do not know, but I guess it is whatever. Well, this is just a great wisdom from Mr. Blue. Alright, time for us to be getting to the next Mr. Blue quest of the day. Getting a good look at the Mr. Blue stuff to be doing today. Hello, I'm Mr. Blue. What are you doing here? Well, I was trying to get a drink from the fountain and, well, looks like I fell into the well. So this isn't quite a well, it's like the sewers. I'm building, I'm building the sewers. Well, that's pretty cool and stuff like that. Well, if you ever well, that's pretty cool and stuff like that. If you need any advice on building the sewers, please let me know. Do you have any advice on building the sewers? You know my price. I, I don't have anything on me right now. Well, my advice for you if you want to make a sewer, well, I'll tell you what. I think if you're trying to make a good sewer and you want to, you want to have a sewer system that is functional and really good, well, maybe what you're going to want to do is making the large passageways so that all the water can go in through and stuff like that. And also what you want to do is maybe have an, uh, a system where maybe like a system of valves and make sure the water can leave where it wants to go and stuff like that. Well, that's the advice that I got for you to make, an, to make a, uh, a sewer system. Well... Yeah. Thank you. I actually really needed that. Thank you, Mr. Blue. Well, my pleasure. Well, I guess I'll be out of here. All right. Did you want a boat or anything to get out? No, I think I'll manage fine. Thank you. All right. What was that? Oh, I'm, I'm watching you wade through the water. Yes, I am wading through the water. It is one of my favorite activities to do as just a little blue guy and stuff like that. That makes sense. Yeah. All right. Well, okay. Well, this is definitely an interesting part of the sewer system. Well, I guess it's time to go. Well, I guess it's time that we're going to get back to the city and maybe talking to some people and whatnot and stuff like that. Revenge and you'll get your bit with him. Oh, I, I mean will. <laughs> hello, I'm Mr. Blue. Oh, hello, <laughs> Mr. Blue. Oh, hi. You again. Good to meet you. Good to see you again. Well, it's good to see you as well, Mr. Ant Venom. Well, how are you doing today? I'm doing great. How you been? How you been enjoying the server? How you been enjoying being uh, being around? I well, mean, I'm I've finding all, a I lot haven't... of fun and being around and walking around and stuff like that and making a bunch of new friends. Well, here's my friend William Worm. Say hi. Sure thing. Hang on. Yo, yo, can I get a picture of you and your buddy William Worm? 
Well, yeah, of course you can get a picture of me and my buddy William Moore. Do you, you want me to set him down like this? Maybe taking a picture like that? Oh, no. Oh, no. You got Oh you, no, you to be hanging on to your buddy. Uh, All right. Well, that is okay with me. Well, take a kay. picture away. Okay. I just had to turn on my shader, so I had to distract there. Oh, perfect, perfect. Hang on, let me get you a copy of this. This this will be all Whoa. yours. Okay, there you go. And the, then I got a copy that goes in my album. Wow, well that is just a beautiful picture of me and William Moore. Well, thank you so much for that picture. It's just so beautiful. Thank you for the opportunity, honestly. It was great to see you again. Well, I'm so happy that to see you as well. And, well, I think you're just a great guy. Well, thanks so much. Ah, uh, thanks so much. You're too kind. Have a great day, Mr. Blue. Well, you as well. Well, that's pretty cool. Well, maybe we're going to put this some other kind of orientation, maybe. Well, that is pretty nice. Mr. Blue and William Worm, friends again at last. Well, looks like the sun is setting, maybe... Well, it looks like the sun is setting. Maybe we're going to go and talk to that tree of wisdom once again. Well, I want to say hello to everybody in the, in the chat that is happening. Well, hello, it's me, Mr. Blue. Well, thank you for the subscription, Very Low Sodium with Prime. Well, thank you so much. Well, I guess it's time to find out where everybody is hanging out at and stuff like that. Well, that was crazy. Whoa. Well, Mr. Blue can do a little fart jump. It's looking like that. Well, that is not good, a good thing at all. That is a creeper. Well, get away from me, creeper. I'm... Well, I'm going to die really soon. Well, this guy's not even going to help me with... Well, I guess I'm just going to get away from that kind of situation right now. Well, looks like that is a challenge accepted. It's time for Mr. Blue to mog the Mog Island. What are you guys thinking about that? Well... I'm going to ask all my fans in the chat, well maybe you guys can make it a Mr. Blue Photoshop of a Mr. Blue Photoshop of Mr. Blue mogging all of these people on Mog Island. Well, maybe maybe that would be really awesome.
Well, time to walk around and checking out all the spots and all the stuff to see and all the sights and whatnot. Mr. Blue, you might want to look out. You might. Well, I've defeated you, foe. Well, that was easy. Well, I do pack a pretty mean Mr. Blue Punch. Ah. Very nice. Well, I guess it's time to go home and maybe hang out at my place in my crib. Well, it looks like we got some mail. Well, isn't that a crazy time? Well, let's read the mail that we got. Well, guys, remember, if you do an exclamation mark postcard, and also if you're check the, checking in the description in the bio, well, $5 for a postcard will send me a postcard. Well, that would be really great. Well, time to give this a read. This is sent to us by Bathtub for Rats, and they're saying, Hey, Mr. Blue, is your mom single? Asking for a friend. Well, you can let your friend know that Mr. Blue Mom is happily married to, um, to Mr. Blue Sr. Well, well, they're having a happy marriage, and, and they've been living for a long time together, and a very happy marriage, so I'm very sorry to tell you that. But tell your friend that I'm, I said I'm sorry that he cannot even having a relationship with my mom. Well, you guys, wait a minute, I'm thinking about something right now. Hold on a freaking second. Wait, are you guys thinking what I'm thinking right now? Uh, I'm thinking about the Mr. Blue merch that is at LucaBigPants.com. Holy crap, you guys, are you guys checking this out right now? Well, that's really freaking crazy. There's a Mr. Blue Vintage t-shirt and there's also a Mr. Blue Vintage crew neck. Well, that is just crazy, question mark. Holy freaking crap. You guys, if, you do, if you're doing exclamation mark merch in the chat, you can get access to this kind of really crazy Mr. Blue merch stuff. Well, that is just crazy and I love this product as well. Well, anyway, that crap is really crazy because it just has a crew neck and it got to drop shoulders. It is having a loose fit and a washed effect. And also it is 100% combed cotton with a 32 count plain weave as well. And it is pre-shrunk and tie-dyed. Well, the fabric weight is 260 gram per square meter. And also it is a side seamed construction well. So that means it is really a strong shirt. And binding tape neck and shoulders as well. And double stitch rib collar. And also it has got a cover stitch cuff with a hem. Well, can you guys freaking believe this? And also it is saying something on the back. The Mr. Blue Show is brought to you by the Big Pants Media Company. The unauthorized reproduction or distribution of Mr. Blue's thoughts, ideas, advice, and infinite wisdom is illegal. For more information, please visit www.mrblue.show. Well, this is a pretty crazy and groundbreaking news that if you do exclamation mark merch in the chat, well, you can find a Mr. Blue merch at lukabigpants.com, L-U-K-A-B-I-G-P-A-N-T-S dot C-O-M. Well, that's crazy. Well, how do you find out when it is supposed to arrive if someone is telling me this? Well, it should arrive within anywhere between one or two weeks if you're in the United States or Europe. But if you're somewhere that is it farther, then it might be a little bit more time to take. Anyway, let's get back to the Minecraft playing of the Minecraft. Well, it's Mr. Blue and Mr. Orange from the Mr. Blue and Mr. Orange show. Well, we are a pretty good friend as well. And it is another Mr. Blue merch. Well, well, this is just awesome and I'm loving having all you fans like you. Look, it is even William Worm from the, from the Mr. Blue and Mr. Orange show. M William Worm. Well, what do you think we should be doing now, right now, Mr. William Worm? Well, someone's asking me what happened if you don't have any money to buying some. How long will the merch be up, please? Well, the merch is going to be up for maybe one or two months. Uh, but I cannot be 100% positive because you never know what things are going to happen. So, well, that is the answer that I got for you. Well, somebody's asking how old are Mr. Blue and Luca Big Pants? 
Well, Luka Big Pants is a guy that is a 23-year-old, but Mr. Blue, well, I am pretty much as old as time itself. Or something like that, maybe the 80s or 90s, perhaps even a longer time ago than that. It's sometime maybe in an October, between October and July. Well, I hope that answered your question. It's looking like there's nobody going on around right now in the place. And honestly, I'm really kind of getting a little stressed out over this kind of fact right now because I'm really trying to hang out with some people and also making some friends. Well, perhaps maybe Bird is around. Well, I'm doing a little fart, I guess. Oh, Hello. Mr. Blue! How Hi, are you Mr. doing, Blue. Mr. Blue? You're Sorry, the blue door wanted to hug you, I think. Well, that's okay. I, I do like a blue door. <laughs> nice, cool. What's up? Well, I'm just hanging out with my buddy William Worm, and well, oh, we're, Willie! Well, we're hanging hey, out Willie? and having a good time, and well, we're just walking around and having a good time as well. Oh, that's awesome! Wait, do you want me to show Willie my my? We're working on the uh, the museum. Have you seen it yet? I showed Luca well, earlier. Well, I have not seen the museum. Well, I'd love to take a look up at that right now. Yeah, if you have time, sure. You have to you have to mind the staircase. It's a little wet, but once you get inside. Well, all right. <laughs> Watch your step here. It's a little wet. Check this out, William. Well, this let is me just be tell you really quick. Museum. Just entering this place is making my computer fan spin up really loud for a split second. That's okay. It'll go away. But it looks like it is fine now, and there is no more lag or anything like that. Yeah, it was just it was just loading in all the art, and then soon you'll be able to put your own up art uh, uh, up art in here, because we're gonna be uh, we're gonna be opening up booths, so you can have your own Mr. Blue art booth in here. Whoa, well, that is crazy. I'd love to doing that and putting maybe an image like this up in the art booth. You know what? How about we 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 got a there we go. We got an extra frame right here. How about Whoa. placeholder, right there. Well, That's a that nice one. A I like fantastic that. Fantastic in Mr. Blue art as well. Classic wow. Mr. Blue. Well, hey, wait! I got awesome. I got something for you. It's some blue. <gasps> well, I'm it matches that. your eyes. Actually, if you need any uh, air for your house. Well, that is crazy. It is a blue. Is it a blue stained glass? A light blue stained glass. Well, thank you so much. Well, that is definitely going to help me with my construction of all my stuff. You're so welcome. Here, uh, I'll see you later, William. It was nice seeing you again. He says. Me and William go way back. Same. He says. He says good to see you as well. I love William. Oh, I'm sure I'm. See I'm sure I'll see him again soon. Well, I'm sure I'll see you as well soon. Well, well, thanks for showing me this. It's quite freaking awesome and stuff like that. Yeah, no, thanks for hanging out. Oh, chat says hello. Chat, uh, chat is a big Mr. Blue fan. Well, what's going on, chat? How's it going, everybody? And, well, my chat also says hello as well. Hello, Mr. Blue chat. It's good seeing you guys again. It's been a while. We'll have to catch up soon. Well, all right. Well, thank you so much for showing me, and I, me and William best be on our way. Isn't that, is that not right, William? <laughs> is that not right, William? Well, William, <laughs> what would you like to do now? Classic William. <laughs> Uh -huh. Well, that is just a funny joke by William. Classic William. That classic is a classic William. classic William joke as well. Well, we're going to go in and do a little strolling around and checking out if anybody wants to hang out and stuff. For sure, yeah. Let me know if you need anything, man. Well, yeah.
Well, I guess let's try to walk around and finding some people. I mean, I don't know where everybody is going on right now and what is happening. Well, don't send thing this person a letter. Please send me a letter because I'm Mr. Blue and I'll answer all of your questions and your wisdom. Well. What's going on? Hello, it's me, Mr. Blue. It's so good to see you. What's up? Well, I'm just hanging out, and I'm just walking around with my with my good buddy William Worm, and William we're Worm? just hanging out and having a good time. Holy shit! The the William Worm? Well, yeah, from that the is show? that is the William Worm from the Mr. Blue and Mr. Orange show. Yeah. Holy shit! That's huge. I can't believe he's here. I I'm fucking. I have two members of the. Sh is is Miss Purple okay? Well, Miss Purple has been in a coma for the last seven years, unfortunately, but, yeah. well, it's really a devastating story for Mr. Purple as well, but, well, it's me, Mr. Blue, and, Mist and Mr. William Worm, and Mr. Orange is on vacation to Cancun right now. Hey, good for him. He's going to turn even more orange. You get that tan in, you know what I'm saying? Well, yeah. Here, let me, let me, let me make a gift for you really quick. Well, I would love a gift. There you go. Well, that is crazy. That is a gift. Well, I just received a gift from Bird, and he's giving me this one. Soon I'm going to have all of the different oh, ones. Oh, yeah. That's good. That's good, too. Well, that's going to be really, really a good time. Yeah. Here, let me let me, let me, me see if I have one more thing for you. Do you want, you want, you want oh, God, I'm lagging. You want to stick around right here just for a sec? Well, I'd love to stick around. Maybe, maybe even, maybe you give me a tour of your house at some point. Oh, really absolutely. Nice. I didn't know you didn't, haven't seen it already. I was, come on in. Well, thank you so much. Oh, well, this is quite a nice floor. It is almost blue, almost. Yeah, there is some blue in here. There's some fish with a little bit of blue, maybe. Well, you were making an XP while you were walking. Yes. I, I, that just happens. That's just the effect I have on people. Well, that's pretty pretty sweet. There you go. One of each. Well, that is definitely a blue thing to add into my blue collection. Well, it is that is blue. just great. Yeah, I feel like it's a very good, like, it's a representation of myself, and, you know, I just feel like you deserve it. Well, thank you so much for that beautiful gift, and I'm definitely going to be using that beautiful gift. And I like that so much. Well, I best be, me and William Warren best be going soon. Absolutely. It was great meeting you, William. He says, he says likewise. I, I'm, I'm honored. I'm so happy. Have a great day, Mr. Blue and William Worm. Well, thank you. Well, William Worm, where do you, well, where do you want to go to now, huh? No, we cannot do that. No. Okay, well, it looks like we're going to be going to find some new friends and hanging out and talking to, to some new friends and stuff. Awesome. Good luck out there. Well, it was good to see you, and if, you definitely, if you're needing any wisdom or anything like that or any, any handyman repair work or stuff like that as well, well, I'm your guy. You can call me any time of the week or the month. So, well, thanks. I will. I will. Thanks for your yeah. patronage. Of course. It's great seeing you. Well, that is a nice guy, Mr. Beef Stew. Well, this is looking like a little thing of ling, but it should be blue.
Well, I'm looking like I'm doing some gambling right now. Well, William Warren, would you like to see me gamble at the slot machine? Well, it looks like it, that's a bust. No. No, that is not something that we are going to be playing right now, I think. Well, I'm thinking that I'm going to be playing a different song completely than that. Maybe perhaps even we're going to be playing a little live stream, perhaps. Well, I do not know what's. Well, I do not know what is going on right now. Well, there we go. It's Mr. Blue's Wisdom, the first original show. Mr. Blue's Wisdom. Can you guys believe in this? Well, oh my God, that's Mr. Blue's Wisdom. You guys. Have you ever been going to the youtube.com slash look at big pants and, well, you go into the stream element, going to exclamation mark VODs, V-O-D-S, and going to find the VOD of the Mr. Blue Show? Well, me and William Warren are going to watch. Well, this is the first official rerun. A little bit of trivia before we start. This is the first official rerun of the Mr. Blue Show. And, well, this is episode... This is... Well, this is season 47, episode 1. Or I guess episode 0 of the Mr. Blue Show. The first rerun. It, it, well, the show is going to take a, maybe a couple minutes to start, but... Well, it's going to be it's going to be worth it for sure. Well, is everybody ready for the Mr. Blue Show? Guys, putting a one in chat if you're ready to see the Mr. Blue Show. And maybe putting a little... Maybe putting the word blue in chat if you're really excited to see the Mr. Blue Show. Well, that's awesome. Well, I guess it's time to watch the Mr. Blue Show. It's taken a while, but here we go. Hello, everyone. It's me, your favorite blue guy, Mr. Blue. And well, today I am going to be answering all of your questions that you might have to ask, well, that you might have to ask me, Mr. Blue. So, here, this is how it is going to work. If you want your message read, and you want me to impart my wisdom to you, well, all you have to do is donate 200 bits on the stream, or a $2 super chat at the minimum. And, well, I will answer all of your questions, and I'll try to impart as much wisdom as I can to you. Well, this is the Mr. Exactly. Blue Show, original Mr. Blue Show from right. from a from I'm a couple months ago. For this kind of stuff that we're going to be doing right now. So, without further ado, I suppose let us get to the first question of the day, which is a question from Fred from Phoenix, Arizona. Good day, Blue Man. How are you doing today? Well, well that's great. That is just a lovely question that I very much love. Well, I'm doing quite good. How are you? 
Thank you so much for the question, and I hope that that question answered all of your question, that my answer got you all the answer. Well, this is the Mr. Blue Show, original Mr. Blue Show, and if you guys are doing exclamation mark B-O-D-S, exclamation mark VODs, well, you can okay. check out the Mr. Blue Show. Not today, no, no. Hi, I'm, I'm Mr. Good. Blue. I'm good, I'm good. Well, anyway, that guy's a bit of a, well, that guy's a bit of a sour fella, I guess. Don't even, doesn't even want to talk to Mr. Blue. Well, this is the Mr. Blue Show from twitch.tv slash lookatbigpants. And, well, I'm really su suggesting that you guys go to the VOD channel and checking it out. Anyway, well, I am loving the Mr. Blue Show. Well, it looks like we got room for one more picture. Wow. Is this Luca Big Pants's Luca Big Pants good friend? Twitch.tv slash Grolix McLaren? Well, I think that that is. Well, this is a really cool guy. Well, I'm going to take a couple flowers from my good buddy Luke of Big Pants and maybe putting them up. Uh. Well, pardon me, it looks like I'm having a lot too many beans, blue beans to eat today. Well, my bad. Well, that's quite nice. Well, this is my beautiful Mr. Home. Right over here. Well, time to put another piece of propaganda on the server maybe perhaps well this looks like a really good as place as any well baths of Farad, thank you for the subscription and the tier one subscription well thank you so much for that Well, what can we doing now, maybe?
Looks like everybody is maybe not even here right now. But I guess it's time for wisdom. You guys, in the chat, what is the best wisdom that you guys take? What is the, what is the best wisdom that you got? And maybe I'll maybe I'll say the wisdom in the well in the chat. Well, thank you, Snodbottoms, for the subscription with Prime. Hmm. Mr. Blue, wisdom of the hour. It's better to shit in the shower than to shower in the shit. That is a pretty good one. Don't put tin foil in the microwave. Well, that is a pretty good one. Life is like a box of chocolates. Well, I... Hmm. Well, supply equals demand. Well, that is a pretty good one. Uh, do not eating... Do not eat spicy food and then touching your eyes or genitals well thank you Quetzal my moderator Quetzal for the advice and the wisdom Well, William Worm, I am bored and I do not even know what to do. Walking around the beautiful place and the beautiful land that we have created, and I, don't, I am just such a bored guy. Well. I guess I could reading some message if you want to send me some postcard. Thank you, Briscoe Country Jr. Briscoe County Jr. Well, thank you, Briscoe County Jr. for the subscription for the one month at the tier at tier one. Well, thank you so much for that. Whoa. Well, thank you, Bray two three five seven. For the 250 bit, whoa, that's that is just a crazy thing. Well, your question is, favorite color still blue? Well, yes, my favorite color is still the color of blue. Is well. yeah. So, well, thank you so much for the question. Well, time to read the new mail, but first I'm going to put my diamonds in the chest. Well, if you guys want to send me some mail, exclamation mark postcard, and it'll bring you to the place where you can send me some mail. And it is a $5 postcard. Alright, well, time to read the postcard. Well, this postcard is sent to us by Mr. Car Painter. Well, time to get in, getting on with the read. Mr. Blue, have you heard of Happy Happyism? Happy Happyism. Well, I've never heard about Happy Happyism, but I definitely know what it. I definitely know about uh, blueism and being a fun little blue guy. Well, well, what is Happy Happyism? Well, I would love to. For you guys to tell me what that is, maybe. Well, thanks so much for the postcard. Well, 
Wiggle, my worm is cheering at 300 bits and, and is saying, Hello, Mr. Blue. Say hi to my cousin, Mr. William, for me. Well, this is Mr. William Worm. And let me talk to him. Well, Mr. William Worm, Wiggle, my worm, is cheering 300 bits and, telling, and wanting me to say that they're saying hi to you. Well, Mr. William Worm says hi back. Well, I guess I'm going to go and read the, the mail that just arrived in my mail. Well, this message is brought to us by JPEG Storm. And, well, this is what it says. Mr. Blue, I'm so drunk right now. Mr. Blue, Mr. Blue, it is out right now and it is purple and purring for you. Meow, cool cat. Well, well, I do not know exactly what you're trying to tell me right now, but, well, that is definitely an interesting thing. Well, maybe you were talking about your little purple worm, perhaps? Just like I have a worm that is pink called William Worm. Well, okay, well, thank you so much, Mr. JPEG Storm, for the message. What a beautiful day. You are making a mess all over the place, Mr. B. Look at all this honey and stuff. Well, okay. Well, what a beautiful day outside today, and it looks like we got some new mail. Hey, Mr. Blue. Did you know that William, Mr. William Worm was a doctor? We studied at the same medical school. Well, that's really cool. I did know that Mr. William Worm was a doctor. And, well, he invented the coronavirus vaccine. Well, time to read a new message. Well, this message is coming to us by the Mr. Car Painter once more. Happy Happyism is all about the color blue and spreading the color blue to all corners of the world so all may live a happy blue life. Well, that just sounds like the perfect kind of ism to me and I really like that kind of thing and I, well, I might be following that. I might be following that uh, from now on, that seems like a really good and also a really fun thing to be doing in life. Hmm. Well, happy happyism sounds like a really good thing, but maybe we can replace the word happy happyism. Maybe we change the name of it to Mr. Blueism. Well, I don't want to be such a guy that with a big ego, but I am Mr. Blue, and well, that is my whole mantra. Well, thank you so much, Mr. Carpenter, for the message. Hey, Mr. Blue, is your blood blue or red, or perhaps an abstract color? Well, the answer is pretty simple, as you might even imagine that my blood is blue. William Worm is edible. Well, I suppose you could eat William Worm if you want, but I would not eat Mr. William Worm. Mr. Blue, this is going to make me sleepy. Well, that is probably good. Maybe you were needing a sleep and, and maybe you needed taking a nap or something. So, sometimes, take, sometimes taking a rest is really good. Mr. Blue, why do I jelk? Well, I'm not sure what a jelking is, but I suppose you do it because it is fi you're finding a pleasure in it and you like doing it. What flavor ice do you prefer? Well, I really like the ice that is a color of, well, that is the color of blue. Blue ice. 
Speaking of sleep, can I get in a good night kiss, please? Well, okay. Mwah. Well, I hope you like that. Mr. Blue, how does blue blood carry oxygen? Is it made of cobalt, perhaps? Well, I don't know if you're ever hearing about liquid colloidal silver, but, well, that's pretty much it. Mr. Blue, have you done your advice of the hour? Yes, Mr. I had done my advice of the hour. And my advice of the hour is Mr. Blue's wisdom of the hour. Do not eat spicy food and then touching your eyes or genit genitals. Well, Bert is talking about Kurt Cobain. Well, okay. Hey, man. Hey, it's me, Mr. Blue. I noticed. Well, I'm going to be honest. I've, I've been walking around and stuff like that, and, well, I'm noticing that there's nothing going on right now, and I'm kind of Mr. Blue bored. That Mr. Blue sucks. There, there's not a lot going on here either. I'm trying to, trying to get ideas for this little build here. I finally got it so that visitors will not drown yet. Well, that is just fantastic. Yeah, I don't like how this kind of, the water kind of goes up a little bit. I don't know if I like it or not. What do you think, Mr. Blue? Should it what stay that, or should I go a little, like, a level lower with the water? Like the water that is coming from here, you mean? Yeah, like, you see how it's, like, a, on par with the stairs? I think it might look a little better if it was below, like, a, like a one block lower. Well, what if you're making it coming out of where the actual w level of the ocean is? That could work too, but I like it's a, it's a little scenic. What well, if yeah, you're totally What if right. I changed the ocean? What if I made the ocean higher? Well, that could totally work. But what if you're putting just a trap door or a half slab down? But that would that wouldn't work though cuz that's where the water is. Yeah, but you're putting it on top of the water. But then what but that would what do you talk what do you mean? Do you have a maybe a some stairs or perhaps some stone or something like that I can show you. Oh no. No, you were right. That does not work at all. Yeah, that's what I'm yeah. Right. That's okay. That that that's my conundrum. You yeah. You're un, you're understanding now. Well, I love understanding. Well I do like this a lot though. I do like that looks good. I think uh Hmm. Yeah, because I'm, I'm not 100% on these, uh, the chiseled ones, so I, that could totally work. I do like that. I'm not 100% I'm not on the arch yet, and I'm not 100% on you keeping the chiseled ones, the kind of placeholders. I like, I like how they look down here. Like, come inside. Well, I, think I also like how they look on the out. bottom of the glass, and then, like, when the stairs, uh, I'll have to change a few of them. I gotta add another layer on the bottom, because I went one down, but, like, I like, I like how they look on the arches right now. Well, I do actually quite like that a lot. Is not a lot of people is using this block, so it looks pretty. pretty yeah, interesting. but but up here, the top of it, it looks a little wonky. So I'll probably end up changing that. I could just do stone bricks for that because I do like that arch a lot. That would make it look really good on the way down. Cause then I could do ooh, cause then I could do stairs on the upper side as well, and that would look way nicer. All right, all right, it's coming together. Oh, and I just happened to come across a bunch of them. Wow, that is just a crazy coinky dink and a coincidence as well. <laughs> Here, I got you a bucket of you. This is my. This is looking like a bucket of blood for me because I'm blue. Wait, can I? Wait, can I have that back for a second? I'll be. I'll be right back. Stay here. All right, man. Oh, you're enjoying that blue. Well, I'm just enjoying the little the water and stuff. Well, here uh, for for giving me that uh, that 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 uh, that swig of inspiration, I got this for you. 
I pulled it out of my secret stash. Whoa. Well, that is crazy. First of its kind, as, as far as I know, so An use it wisely. Blue. Well, that is crazy, and I'm definitely going to be using that very wisely. Well, I'm going to put this in my ender chest so it never gets lost. Yeah, for sure. Well, I'm Mr. Blue, and this has been a really fun time, and, well... Let me know if you need any any advice or anything related to the any stuff that you're doing right now. Yeah, I will. Oh, can you let Luca know that I I had an epiphany and I went uh cuz cuz these the uh, the twisted stone here. He was looking for these. Um I went to the twilight because it's part of the same mod pack looking for pillars because I figured maybe even if you can't like make them, maybe you could find them. I have not found them yet though. Ah, well, I see. I will certainly be letting him know about that. We we might, though. Maybe we'll come across him. We never know. Well, I'll definitely let him know, and I definitely, hopefully, we'll find some of that stuff. Yeah, yeah. Maybe, maybe, maybe. If, if I come across him, I'll definitely, like, toss him an email or whatever. Well, all right. That sounds really good and great as well. Oh, uh, and Andrea MJK says, Mr. Blue is beautiful. Well, I am just smiling and blushing so hard. Well, I well, I do like that. That is a really fun thing that you're saying to me right now. Well, I'm smiling so hard that you can see my big blue teeth. Yeah. <laughs> there they are. Mm, I'm smiling so hard. Mm. Mm. Well, hey, do you want a bug? It's not blue, but do you want a bug? Well, I love little bugs and little buggy friends. Hold on, I'll be right back. Well, here you go. You can hang out with William. Maybe they'll get along. What was that? I think that was a, the bug that was making a noise. Well, I I don't I don't know if that was the bug or not. I just I was well, asking what that was. Looks like this is Mr. Fucking Bug. <laughs> yeah, it's, I figured he and William could probably get along. All right. Uh, have a good night, Mr. Blue. <laughs> well, well. <clears throat> well, that is such a kind gesture from the bird giving me Mr. F Giving me Mr. Fucking Bug. Well, that's pretty cool. Well, Mr. Fucking Bug and Mitt William Worm, well, introduce yourselves to each other. Well, be nice, William Worm. This is just a new guy called Mr. Fucking Bug who's really cool. Well, looking like our friend Joko is joining the game. Well, I'm not even going to say anything to him. I'm just going to go and talk to him right now. Well, look, an egg, one egg for a day keeping the doctor away for sure. Looking like we make three ducks.
Mr. Blue, what is your favorite sporting activity? Well, I love fencing. It is looking like Joko is in his evil little basement. Well, I do not know what that is meaning. Wow, a fiend! Well, looks like we took care of that guy. Well, that is Joko's home. Well, look at how nice that home is. Well, I'm wondering where I'm wondering where our good friend Joko might be. Hello, I'm Mr. Blue. Hello, Mr. Blue. It was great seeing you again. Thank you. Well, it was good to see you as well. Hello there, Mr. Blue. Hello, it's it's me, Mr. Blue. Hi, Mr. Joko, Blue. have you met Mr. Blue? I, I think I may have briefly met Mr. Blue one time. How's it going, Mr. Blue? Well, my I'm friend Mr. Blue. Very blue. Well, I'm well, I'm doing really good, Mr. Joko. Well, it's nice to see you have again. Have you met Yahia Maestro? Oh, oh my god. Hey, what's up, man? Nah, I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I'm doing something else. All right, Joe. Okay, 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 let's okay. go back. Let's go back. We have okay. serious business, don't we? Serious business, yes. Okay, so as you're saying, Mr. Blue, what's going on here? Well, as I was saying, I'm doing pretty good, and I, I just wanted to come and take a little walk around, a little stroll, and checking out what's going on. Well, oh, yeah. how are you doing? I'm doing, I'm doing okay. I've been submitting myself to, like, intermittent torture over the past 48 hours. So, I'm in a pretty weak mental state. Well, uh, but other than that, doing pretty good. I can understand being in a weak mental state if you're if you if Yahya Mice is walking around for sure. Oh yeah. Place. Oh yeah. Well. Yeah. Well, I just met I just met a new friend today. Well, this is my friend William Worm. <gasps> William. And well. Oh. oh, and oh well, hold on. Sorry. As sorry. well, this is also my my other friend, Mr. Fucking Bug. And Ooh. well, we're just the three of us are just walking around and having a really good time together. And I wanted wanted to introduce you to them. That's awesome. Well, thank you for the introduction. They they seem very chill. It's Mr. Deucing Bug and William Worm. I love that. Well, yeah. Ooh, you're double fisting. I like that. I'm fucking with that. You got the well, homies riding along with you. It's me and my little homies, and we're riding along and having a fun time as well. That's great. That's fucking great. Well, yeah. Well, I've been having a really fun time walking around with these two little guys. Well, this is quite a nice house that you got here as well. What's with Thank the cross? Thank you. Yeah. Um, there's like a there's like a part in the chunk where it just lags every single time you walk across. Uh, it's it's like this line. Uh, yep. Ow, fuck. Every time. It's... Ah! Well, oh. I'm experiencing a similar thing as well at, on Luca Big Pants' stream. Oh, uh, okay. And, well, that is somewhere over there, and it well, it was it was because of uh, Bird's photos that he's having in his aquarium house, so... Oh, was that well, it? once he's moving all that stuff, it the lag has got a lot better, so maybe there's something oh. in this general vicinity, and not even chunk-specific... That is maybe causing something evil, like perhaps something evil, like that is maybe loading up too, too many resources and making the chunk really laggy or something. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. That's exactly what I was thinking. There's something hmm. here. There's something here that's definitely very evil. It well, must I'm be not, exercised. I'm not seeing a thing that is evil around here. Perhaps it is hidden. Well, I guess I, we'll I, never That's know. what I'm thinking. It could be at the bottom of this pit and... I'm not sure, though. There might be something horrible down there. Well, I can find out. Hello, it's me, Mr. Blue. How are you doing today? Well, 
Well, there was nothing down there. Well, there was no evil down there, so I think we're all good. Okay, well, thank you for vetting that, Mr. Blue. I, That is a big relief to know that there's nothing particularly evil down there. Well, that's just good to know. And, well, I really hope we're finding whatever the evil source of this evil is, because we are in the vicinity of a church, so... That is true. There, there can't really be evil outside the grounds. That would be kind of messed up. Yes. Oh, my... Well, how? This guy's cranking out progress on this build. Jesus Christ. Well, Mr. Joko, do you mind if Ignore I maybe me. go on AFK in your house for a second? I gotta go and do something. Oh, yeah, if you would like to, I, absolutely yeah. go for it, Mr. Blue. I do not mind. Well, thank you so much. I gotta go and practicing my Blue-O-Lingo, so... Oh, yeah, dude, same. I actually lost my streak yesterday. It pissed me off. Well, that is just not even good at all. You're not even getting a blue streak freeze or anything like that? I know. No, I've re I, I burned two of my blue streak freezes, and then I uh, then I lost my streak. I fucked up real bad. I did three days in a row where I forgore. Well, I got a streak of 115 days that I do not want to get rid getting rid of, and I got six minutes to doing it, so... Well, thanks for letting me stay AFK in your house as well, and I'm just gonna, just gonna, not gonna take as much as, what, well, I'm Mr. Blue. Well, guys, I'm gonna take in a little quick break, a little quick Mr. Blue break, and I'm gonna be right back, you guys, and I'm just gonna practice my Duolingo, uh, and we're gonna, maybe, uh, look at the merch. Well, that's crazy. Well, here's Mr. Blue Wisdom. Here's Mr. Blue's wisdom, and I'm gonna play this for you guys, and I'll be right back. My apartment, and I leave the, my apartment. I realize that I'm not chained down by any. I'm not. I'm not chained down by anyone, and I can kind of go wherever I'm, I want as well. So, realistically, when I am walking around, I am unchained, and I can maybe go to Puerto Rico, or I can go to any country I want. So, I am a free guy, I think. Also, I'm blue. <laughs> well, I hope that answered your question. Well, now we're gonna go to the next question. The next question comes from Corvus, and they are asking me, are you red? I don't know why you are trying to offending me, perhaps, but that is not a question that I am wanting to answer at this time, because, well, I think it is obvious that I am blue. Do you not think that it is, that, that, is it obvious that I am blue as well? Um, yeah. Maybe next time you should check your privilege as well for that kind of stuff. Sorry if I'm seeming angry at you, but... I just, this is making me a little angry and upset, but I guess it's time for the next question. Well, the next question comes to us from Miku Donaru Dosu from Alaska. Mr. Blue, help me please. I ate too many shrimp and became pink. Is there a cure? Well, how many shrimp does it have to take to make your make, making your skin turn pink? I do not know. <laughs> but if you're eating so many, maybe that is the reason that your skin is getting really freaking pink. And, well, honestly, it is not really a big deal because being a, the color of a skin that is a color in the rainbow is kind of low-key chill AF. Well, you seem right now, for me, I am blue. Well, let me say really quickly. Let me say really quickly, uh, I'm going to tell you right now. If you were pink, well, maybe stop eating so many shrimp. I don't think it is going to be bad for your health if you keep eating the shrimp like that. So, well, I don't know. Anyway, thank you very much for asking all the question. And it looked like maybe there was a little issue with the sound, but I'm hoping that you can all hear me very good now. Well, <laughs> I'm so glad everybody can hear me all, all good and stuff. But, okay, well, it's time for the next question. Well, the next question is from Slorno. <laughs> Mr. Blue, stop giving advice on turning people blue. My little brother Dylan is indigo now that he only eats what you told him. Can you reverse this? Well, Slorno, <laughs> I am having a really hard time understanding why you would want to change perfection. The color blue is the perfection color, and the best color that there is of all time. So. Uh, it sounds to me like you're maybe even a hater. Could that be possible? Well, listen. 
I'm not one guy to mess to meddle in you guys' affair and all that as well, but I'm gonna tell you right now. I think that if he is indigo, that is totally a okay. But anyway, the point is, you can't reverse it, and he's going he's going to be a blue color indigo for the rest of him life. So, <laughs> sorry about that. Well, time for the next question. Well, it looks like the transition is uh, no longer doing a slide transition. Can we go back to the last question and see how that worked? Oh, well, see that is functioning properly now. Well, this is quite an interesting phenomenon that has happened. Oh. Well, problem solved. The producer is giving me a big thumbs up. <laughs> well, okay. Seth R. Something is a caller that is asking the question of this. If I can put pineapple on pizza, can I put it in a burger too? And also, the minimum to send bits is 250. Oh my freaking goodness. Is that real? Did I making the minimum to sending a bit 250 bit? I am so freaking clumsy. Clumsy as, as well. Well, I suppose that is not that big of a deal. I guess on Twitch it is going to be, have to be 250 because there is no way to changing that right now. I am so sorry, you guy. Well, at least there is a minimum, so people know that there is a minimum that they can not having to put that much, not having to put that much in a, uh, 250 bits. Wait, are you freaking telling me right now that? Well, I guess it's gonna. Ha well, okay. So the next time for the next question. The next question is, the next question is asking us from us, is at being asked by Lorsom Gregory, and Lorsom Gregory is asking, who are the top three people you're trying to avoid? Well, I'm gonna be honest with you right now, there is a guy right now, there's a couple people that I do not like, at all, and I'm gonna tell you, I'm gonna tell you all the reasons for for me not liking them. Well, number one, I'm trying to avoid Ted Cruz because he's kind of a nasty little rat man. He's kind of like a little rat guy. And he has rat qualities that are not making me liking him as well. Well, that's person number one. And now the person number two that I'm not trying to fuck with right now, low key on some real shit, is Kyle Ritten. <laughs> well, the second person that I'm not trying to fuck with, low key, Well, the second person I'm not trying to f be fucking with right now is Kyle Rittenhouse, because really, let's be honest with each other, with ourselves right now, all that that guy Kyle Rittenhouse has done is, like, kill two people, and he got he getting famous from it, so I don't understand why he's a left, a right-wing talking point. But anyway, enough of that, because the number one person that I'm trying to avoiding right now is Mr. Orange. I don't know if you guys are keeping up with the news, but Mr. Orange is becoming really aggressive and really bad on social media, and he's threatening me earlier today, which is why I had to make the stream a little bit delayed. So, I am not fucking with Mr. Orange right now, and, well, I might even be getting a restraining order on him, because that is a little effed up. I think that is a little effed up to be doing that as well. So, look, all I'm saying is Mr. Orange and I, well, we used to have a show back in the day as well, and it was called the Mr. Blue and the Mr. Orange Show. And, well, we had a show that ran for 47 seasons, and it was a really good show, and me and Mr. Me and Mr. Orange and also Mrs. Purple and also William Worm having a great show, and, well, unfortunately, Mrs. Purple is in a coma, and I haven't talked to William Worm in quite a long time, but Mr. Orange is, well, he's just being a really, aggr a really aggressive guy, and, well, I'm not really fucking with him right now, so that is definitely a guy that I'm trying to avoid in my life right now. Well, thank you, Mr. Lorsom Gregory, for, all the, for the question, and it's time for the next question. Well, Iona Dev is asking a really good question. Have you been hearing about the new Mr. Blue merch at LucaBigPants.com? Well, wait a minute. Hold on. Are you freaking telling me that there's a new that there's a new Mr. Blue merch? Wait a second. That has got to be some sort of joke. Am I right? Wait. Hold on. Let me. The pr producer pulling this up for me right now. I might actually. Not even kidding. Oh 
Uh, I mean, if you can, you can look through my chest and see if you find one, but I don't know. How these chests are really laggy. Yeah. Well, do you think it's the amount of rat photos? Would that have anything to do with it? Even if they're in the chest, would they? Are you freaking kidding me right now? That is such a freaking insane thing. Oh my God, you guys, are you freaking seeing this? There's new merch at LookTheBigPants.com of Mr. Blue T-shirt. Holy crap! Let's go back and see this again. Holy crap! Can you click on one of those, producer? Holy freaking crap! And you can ordering it too as well. Wait, let us see the back of this shirt. I want to see the swag. Wow, that is such a swag shirt. I cannot wait to be ordering this. Well, hold on. I'm going to go and get right, something right now in the, in, the, in, the, in the office really quickly. And hopefully I'm going to be demonstrating to you guys better what is going on right now because this is a really high moment. Oh my, I'm not finding it right now. This is really an awkward time. Um, <laughs> get rat photos that are in chest. Should I like burn them or well, something? That's the well, one second, you guys. I'm going to have to hold it with you really quick. Can I actually, can I put them in furnaces? I Whoa. will do that. You guys, the Mr. Uh, Blue merch at LucaBigPants.com. World, you could. In, yeah, in, in a, we're all in schlatz. Well, that is just what crazy. In a society. We are all dogs in schlatz hot car. I'm Mr. Blue. We're all dog in schlatz hot car. <laughs> Please break the window. Please break the window. Let me out. Did you finish your Duda Dingo? Well, yeah, I finished my Duolingo and I got a my streak is extended for finally. It's good. So That's awesome. I'm glad to hear that, Mr. Blue. Yeah. Well, that's pretty awesome. That is pretty awesome. I'm proud of you, dude. Keep up that streak. Don't be like me. Don't lose your streak. Keep it going. Well, right? I'll try to keep it going as far as I can and as good as I can. Well, yeah. Well, this is quite a nice little attic that you got here. Well, I'm sorry for intruding, but, well, this is a nice view and everything like that, too. Yeah, it's, it's, it's all right. It's okay. It's nothing special, but, you know, it's mine, so it's cool. It's my little Well, place. I can imagine sitting here and enjoying the view wearing my Mr. Blue shirt, limited edition Mr. Blue shirt. Dude, I'd love to have one of those one day. Well, maybe if you go to lukabigpants.com, L-U-K-A-B-I-G-P-A-N-T-S dot C-O-M, well, maybe you can get a new, uh, Mr. Blue shirt. You know what? I may have to do that, actually. I may have to. Well, William Worm and, and Mr. Fucking Bug would definitely definitely agree with that kind of Yeah, they would, they would definitely right? vouch. They would, they would, yep, nope, they're telling, yep, hold on. What was that? Oh, yeah, William definitely vouches, yep, and, and Mr. Fucking Bug, yep, totally agrees. Totally agrees, absolutely. Well, I'm glad my good buddies, Mr. William Worm and Mr. Fucking Bug, will agree with that. Well, somebody in the chat is saying that they are having a 467-day streak, German streak on Duolingo. Well, that's really freaking cool. Well, someone is, ask, someone is asking, uh, someone is asking how, what Mr. Fucking Bug feel about Kyle Rittenhouse. Well, Mr. Fucking Bug, what do you think about Kyle Rittenhouse? Ooh, same. Yeah, I do not. I do not like Kyle Rittenhouse either. Well, the chat is telling me to say something in German. Well, hello, wie geht's? Well, yeah, ich bin good. Well, it looks like I'm being thrown around by maybe a demon or something. Well, it looks like I'm being tossed around like a little demon or something. I don't know what's going on. Well, I don't know what's going on right now. Oh, look! It, it is slightly green Luca, and he is liking this. Well, that's... Well, I better get out of here before I get tossed around again.
Well, that's just crazy. And you guys, if you're enjoying all this, go to lookabigpants.com and getting a get a look at uh, Mr. Blue sh shirt. Well, looks like somebody's making a really good art. Holy crap, you guys. Wait a freaking second. Okay, you guys. We're going to have to check this out. Mr. Blue's mogging advice. Well, that's definitely going to go up on the on the mogging island. Let's go and take care of that right now. And maybe after that we can make an evil, blue, evil, mis not evil, just a normal Mr. Blue secret lair underneath Mr. Blue's house. What are you guys thinking about that? What do you think about that, Mr. Fucking Bug and Mr. William Worm? Well, I absolutely agree. Mr. Blue, are you low-key fucking with Mr. Fucking Bug? Well, yeah, he's been a pretty chill guy thus far, so I'm, I am effing with him, so to speak. Well, we're gonna have to get a little bit of a, some leather and also some. Oh, we have a we have a mail. Well, time to read the mail. Mr. Freaky has sent us a postcard and asked, Salutations, Mr. Blue. Longtime watcher, first time postcarder. Is it true you and Mr. Red are not on talking terms? Also, please pet William Worm for me. Well, thank you so much for the question that... For, thank you so much for that, Mr. Freaky. Well, me and Red are... Never really been a good friend, and I never invited him on the show except for that one episode. Uh, and, well, let's just say it was not a really good episode for me and Mr. Orange. But, I haven't talked to him since that time, but I'm sure we can settle our differences at some point, and I'm hopeful for the future. And, well, let me pet William Worm. Well, alright. Time for the next question. Fuck you, Mr. Blue. Curse of Ra upon your bloodline. Mr. Red, I cannot believe that you can sending me this mail right now. That is effed up, and I do not want you to contact me again. I will send you a cease and desist letter, maybe a restraining order. Now get that now get the H away the H E double hockey stick away from me now, okay? Well, time for the next question. My dearest blue, my purple worm, it's, well, it is palpitating and oozing. Is this normal? Does your blue one do this? Thank you, Dr. Blue. Well, I'm not sure what this means. I... I don't exactly know, I don't, I don't not know what you mean by my blue worm, but I do have a little pink worm named William Worm. So, well, and he is not oozing and palpitating at all, so I did, did not understand this question, but thank you JPEG Storm for the postcard, <clears throat> and I wish you luck with your endeavors. Well, if you want to send me a postcard, all you got to do is go to, all you got to do is do exclamation mark postcard, and you can, it's giving you a link to send the postcard. Uh-huh. 
Whoops, looks like I did a little Mr. Blue toot from my little Mr. Butt. Oops, another little toot. Whoops, well that is not what I was trying to do at all. Well, thank you, Teeter the Hoon, because now we're going to be using your picture for a new Mr. Blue in, for a new Mr. Blue. Mr. Blue mogging advice. Well, that's just great. Well, I guess get mogged. Well, that's looking really great. It is an excellent addition to Mog Island. Absolutely, I totally agree. Well, that's looking pretty good. Well, can we get a bunch of W in the chat? Well, that is just excellent. <coughs> Mr. Blue mocking advice. <coughs> well, it looks like the little guy is stuck. <coughs> Finally, he is sucking the nectar of his sweet flower. Well, I guess it's time we can put down another fun little picture. This one is brought to us by a guy called Vimeo. Mr. Blue is doing blue collar work. House remodeling, landscaping, and much more. And you can take in a flyer as well. Well, perhaps we ought to put this up somewhere where everyone can see it. This is a strange M. I'm not... This is a straight, very strange M. It kind of looks like it is saying, er, ill, er, or maybe a th ill, er. 
Well, I do not know. Hey, Mr. Blue. Small fan here. How are you, Mr. Blue? Well, I'm doing pretty good, but I wish you were a bigger fan. This looks like a great place to put the Mr. Blue. Well, that's just excellent. Well, I'm sorry to the person who's making this one real quick, but I'm going to replace it. Well, that just looks great. Walking around this landscape, I'm thinking it needs a little bit more blue, I think. Let's go home and think about this. But not before we answer our mail. This is sent to us by Ball Club TV, and the postcard reads, Hey, Mr. Blue. I was wondering if you would enjoy being on our talk show, Toodaloos and Tickles from Ball Club TV. Well, Ball Club TV, if you were doing a if you were doing a talk show, please communicate with my secretary and manager, Mr. Luca Big Pants. And well, maybe something like that could be totally arranged. Totally arranged, but it cannot be a competing show with the Mr. Blue Show. Otherwise, I will not be a part of it. Well, thank you for the postcard, Ball Club Ball Club TV. Well, I'm thinking that we're needing an evil basement, perhaps down here? Hmm, I'm thinking about this. Maybe we need some blue blocks as well. Well, this will certainly be a tricky little secret.
Well, this is going to be quite the fun time. And I'm going to put some a little bit of stuff in my inventory as well. Well, it looks like we're finding a cave now. Well, how interesting is that? Well, this is going to be quite a fun little evil basement that we're going to be doing a lot of operations and dealing a lot of stuff in here. Mr. Blue, can you make Blue Ladder? Well, no, unfortunately I cannot make, a, make it a Blue Ladder. Well, sorry to say that. Well, this is an interesting tunnel that we are having in our basement. What? Whoa. Looks like we're finding something here. Well, this will be perfect. Well, I think we got a door somewhere else, but we can make another one. Well, it looks like this is all of our this is our basement now. All of this. Well, that's pretty great. Mr. Blue, will you produce and distribute blue from your basement? The HOA is, well, open to such business. Well, perhaps I will. I do like the HOA and stuff like that, so maybe I'll try to do that kind of stuff.
Well, this is quite great. I think it is time for another Mr. Blue Wisdom of the Hour. What kind of wisdom should I be spreading in this lovely Minecraft server, you guys? Please give me some, give me your best wisdom in the chat, and I'll try to get, get the wisdom out there. Mr. Blue Wisdom of the Hour. Shower so you're not stinky. 90% of gamblers quit before they win big. The bigger the pants, the longer the tooths. Never shake a spider twice. You're not low-key fucking with each other if you don't say hello. A man with long arms never spends a day not hugging. Well, I don't like any of this. I'm going to be putting my advice of the day. Always bet on blue. Well, looking like all the people of the SMP are really enjoying my wisdom. Well, this is quite awesome. What a great little abode that we have all to ourselves now. What is this? Well, no matter. Well, looking like you can do all sorts of really effed up thing in this game. Making a cocaine, making a hemp seed, making an opium, and also a... Making hemp and cocaine and opium? Well, I would like to know how to make some of this. Well, I guess I don't know how to make any of this. How do I craft? How do I crafting this? Read my earlier messages from the next hour. Oh, read my earlier messages for the next hour, Mr. Blue. I was rather late to the last one, and I humbly apologize. Well, I'm not sure exactly what you were talking about, but. Well, either way, that well, that's pretty cool. Well, I'm just noticing that somebody is giving a 250-bit uh, about an hour ago, and they're saying, Hey, Mr. Blue, do you have any color recommendations? Well, yeah. My recommendation is the color blue. Well, thanks. Well, what a nice, pleasant day outside.
Well, Mr. Blue's secret evil, secret little dungeon is looking a little, coming along really nicely, I think. Mr. Blue, how are you feeling about God? Well, I'm thinking of God is real, he is blue, I think. Otherwise, God is dead. If God is not a blue guy, I do not know what to believe in. Well, this is quite great. Well, the Mr. Dungeon is looking quite good so far. I'm trying to make it looking like a cave. Well, looks like we got some mail in our mailbox. Guess, guess we gotta check that. Check that out. Well, time to read the mail. And this message is sent to us by Mrs. TV Studio Executive. Mr. Blue, Mr. Blue, can you please explain this image? Ask for your renewal. Well, unfortunately, I cannot clicking on this link or copying this link. Uh, well, this is quite, quite awkward. Well. Well, I'm not sure what I'm what I'm gonna do right now about this, but well, I'm not gonna typing it out because there's a lot of letters in it and a lot of, lot of numbers as well. Well, thank you so much for your postcard, Miss TV Studio Executive. Well, look is looking well it is looking like we're getting a raid from the guy that is they calling Bird Boy. Well, <laughs> looks like the chatters are saying a lot of funny stuff like I love blue crystal and smoking blue crystal and smoke I love blue crystal and smoking them. I love Mr. Blue. Long live Mr. Blue. Well, thank you so much. Well, that is just craziest crazy situation. Well, right now we're doing a little bit of reading some messages and we're putting around some Mr. Blue propaganda as well. Well, if you want to send a postcard, it is a postcard, exclamation mark, postcard. Well, time to give this a read. Well, this postcard is sent to us by basically Wiz. Hi, Mr. Blue. I think you should check out Eiffel 86. They have a song, and I think you'd love, that I think, I think you'd love. Say hi to Glimbo for me. Well, I am not a guy that is knowing who Glimbo is. But, well, I think that guy's a little goblin, and I don't know anything about him, but as far as I'm concerned, he is wanted by the law, and we should probably put him in jail for the crimes that he is committing, but okay. Well, I want to take a quick thank you again to Mr. Bird. Well, I want to 
say a quick thank you again to Mr. Bird for the raid. Well, thank you so much for that and all of the new viewers definitely all liking Mr. Blue and stuff like that. Well, I'll definitely have to check out Eiffel 86. Well, it sounds like a really fun, fun thing. I hope that they got a good song, maybe about being blue or being a blue guy. Well, thank you so much. Well, it looks like we got a new mail. Time to read the new mail. Well, this is sent to us by Chubsy909. Well, time to read. I love blue crystals and smoking them. Long live Mr. Blue. Well, that is just flipping awesome and also super cool as well. Well, thank you so much for that gen for the for the postcard and saying that you love Mr. Blue and long live Mr. Blue and you love smoking blue crystals. Well, I got to agree with you as well. I think smoking a blue crystal is really a good cool and fun thing as well. And I'm just feeling really blue about that. Well, Thank you so much for the postcard. And I want to say a quick thank, thank you as well to the people that are watching on YouTube. Well, thank you the ghost, ghostly appearance that is the mysterious ghost on YouTube for giving the 25, 25, gifting 25 membership. You are on track for being the guy who was, who, who was like the greatest guy in the YouTube chat, I think. I think you are the greatest guy in the YouTube chat now. Thank you so much for that, very much, Mr. Mr. No Name Guy with the Ghost Profile Picture. And also, JPEG Storm with the $2 on YouTube. Hey, Mr. Blue. Is it blue? Much love from Iowa. Well, it is indeed blue, I'll tell you what. Well, time to go look at... It is an Ant Venom. Whoops. Hello, I'm Mr. Blue. Hello. I had to find you there. How are you? I'm Mr. I'm Mr. Blue. <coughs> How are you doing today? I'm 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 doing great. I'm in search of wool to see if anyone has any because I want to place a banner at my house. Well, isn't that reasons. a crazy coincidence? I got some wool at my my good buddy Luca Big Pants' house. We can go and get it right now if you want. Uh, sure, if you can spare six of them. Well, yeah, absolutely, for sure. We can totally do that. Sweet, thank you so much. Well, isn't that just a nice guy named Ant Venom? Well, this is my good buddy Luca Big Pants' house, and we're really good friends, so I guess he doesn't mind if... <laughs> We come in here. Whoa. Yeah, I mean, if you know, if you, if you, if you say so. There's a sign that. Well, it is a blue frog. How about that? Well, that is really nice and cool. It's like glows in the dark. Do you have any idea what that noise is? Well, that is a cicada, I believe, like a bug. Oh, okay. I didn't realize that yeah. we had those. That's awesome. Yo, thank you well, so much. Well, there's a six white wool. Yo, thank you so much. That's, like, super useful. I, I had no idea uh, if anyone around here was selling it or if there was any sheep farm. So you just saved me, like, ten minutes of walking, so thanks. Well, it's my pleasure, of course. I'm, I'm Mr. Blue, and if you need any wisdom or advice or anything, well, I'm your guy. I have... One question. Well, Why Mr. I, Blue? Why not like Mr. Green or Mr. Red, or Mr. Purple, Yellow, Magenta, any other color? Why Mr. Blue? Well, perhaps you might want to take a seat for this one. All right. Well, my name is Mr. Blue, and I'm just a blue guy, and I'm just kind of trying to be a chill guy and spreading a lot of wisdom. But the reason that I'm not any other color other than blue is because that's just the way that I was born. Now... There is a guy that is called Mr. Orange, and me and Mr. Orange used to have a show back in the 90s called the Mr. Blue and Mr. Orange Show, and it also uh -huh. featured my good buddy, Mr. William Worm. Oh, oh, that's where William Worm comes from? Yeah, my good buddy, William Worm, me and him and Mr. Orange had a good, had a show back in the 90s, and wow. well, there is a guy that is named Mr. Green, and there's a guy that is named also Mr. Red, but I don't like that guy. Okay, all right. Gotcha. And also, Mr. and Mrs. Purple. Unfortunately, Miss, Mrs. Purple has been in a coma for seven months. 
Seven years. Oh, wow. That's yeah. Seven years. That's brutal. Yeah, well, it's not looking good. The prognosis is not looking good at all. But, well, it is what it is, and that is the life. Yeah. Wow, being born Mrs. Purple. Rough life. Well, it would have been better if she was blue. <laughs> Are you saying you had a thing for Mrs. Purple? Well, no, I am I was married to my wife called Mrs. Blue, but unfortunately she passed because of blue disease. Oh, I'm so sorry that blue disease took her. That's so sad. I'm well, really sorry to hear that. Well thank well thank you for saying that, but well it's been quite a long time and well she's living still in my big blue heart, so Mmm. Forever and always. All I can do now is, I guess, raising awareness for blue disease. Hmm. Well, now I know about it. I will, uh, you know, I, I'm going to have to look into it. Well, you know, yeah. be, be sure to Be sure to educate myself. Well, if you're wanting to do such a thing, well, definitely... Oh. 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 I guess I'm down here now. All right. Uh -huh. Did you okay. do any fart? Uh, I, 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 I do, I do recall seeing, hearing that come from your direction, but I mean, we don't, we don't need to, we don't need to toss the blame out, you know, I mean, you, look, you, you see, you, you seem like a great guy and I'm just, I'm just going to go this way. You, I can't get out this way. I'm going to go no. this way. I can't get out this way. I'm going to go this way. I'm not actually uncomfortable. I'm just playing with you. I hope you have a great day. Well, okay, I hope you have a great day as well. If you Everyone ever need any older. wisdom, please come to Mr. Blue. <laughs> Will do, Mr. Blue. The best of the Mr. Colors. Well, I appreciate one. that. Well, thank you so I, much, Mr. Hand Venom. I appreciate you spreading your positivity around the SDMP. Have a good night. Well, you too. Well, that is a nice guy named Ed Venom. Well... Holy crap, I'm just noticing that there's a, been a raid now from Mr. Joko. Well, that's just freaking crazy. I love Mr. Blue. Well, thank you so much, Joko, and I am hope you're having a really good stream. Well, what's going on, everybody? Well, my name is Mr. Blue, and I know that right now I am streaming from a Luca Big Pants account, but I am Mr. Blue. <laughs> Do you not like it? Okay. What? Well, that was pretty crazy. Well, I'm sorry, Joko, that you're having to see that now. Wow, look at it, looking like you guys are making the Luca Big Pants account having 10,000 followers. Well, that is just crazy. Well, a lot of people are asking me if I'm ever going to get my own account. Well, I'm pretty comfortable streaming on Luca Big Pants account, so I guess it's chill. Well, all right. I'm going to read my mail. Well, this postcard is sent to Mrs. TV Exec's roommate. Well, time to reading this. As per Mrs. TV expects last message, it is a link to the art in the Discord. Oh my worm! Well, looks like there's an art in the Discord. Exclamation mark Discord if you guys are wanting to check out the Discord, and we can check that out right now. Well, thank you so much. Let's take a look at maybe some of the art in the Discord that someone's talking about. Oh. Well, this is a Well, this is certainly Well, this is certainly art that is made of me, Mr. Blue and Mr. Orange kissing. Well, me and Mr. Orange might not having that kind of relationship in real life, but I certainly can appreciate it, our friendship. Well, Well, I guess we can put that up. 
on the wall, perhaps. Well, sorry this is taking some time, but, well, I always do appreciate a good art of Mr. Blue and Mr. Mr. Blue and Mr. Orange. Well, that is just lovely. Well, it is time to getting back to the, to the game of Minecraft and maybe going to make some new friends and talk to some people. What do you guys think about that? Well, I think that's a great idea. Well, let's take our buddy William Worm and Mr. Fucking Bug and, well, maybe go off on a little adventure. What are you guys thinking about that, huh? Well, I think that's a great idea. Well, where is everyone? Hello, it's me, Mr. Blue. Is anyone around? Well, I'm just trying to have fun and hang out and have some good friends. Oh, well, it looks like we got some friends over here in this direction. Look, it's a big F for foolish Kia. Made out of bones. Mr. Blue. Guess how many blocks we made. Well, hold on, here comes Mr. Blue. Hello, Mr. Blue. Hello, it's me, Mr. Blue. What's going on, Hi. Justin and Kelly? Hello. Oh. Not much. Uh, we're working on making some bone blocks. Wow, well, this is definitely a big F, or maybe maybe it is a incomplete D. Or it perhaps be, it is yeah. a sailboat with two sails, or perhaps it is a creature that is looking to the left with a really long neck. Well, if your imagination is as blue as mine, it can be anything you want. That's true. Hey, let me introduce you to my friend, William Worm. Oh, where is he? Oh, hold on. There we go. William Worm. I... And let me introduce you to my friend, oh. Mr. Fucking Bug. <laughs> oh, nice. Well, oh, yeah. the three of us have been walking around and wandering around and just having a great time. And, well, I wanted to introduce them to you because... Well, you guys are really nice, and they're also really nice people as well, and we could all be great big friends. I would love to be friends with uh, William the Worm. Of and, uh, the course. Well, that's just awesome. Yeah. Well, William the Worm? Well, Mr. Fucking Bug? What do you guys think we should be doing right now? Oh, yeah? Yeah. Well, that's a great idea, William Worm. What? Mr. Bug? Well, I am flattered. All right, William. That's a great idea. What do you think, Mr. Bug? I totally agree. Well, you heard the bugs. We're gonna go off on a little adventure. Hey. Oh, nice. Mr. Blue, how about some? Yeah. How about some blue pants? What do you think of that? Well, these are certainly a lot of. These are certainly a blue pants. They are indeed. For do you, you like them? Well, I like them quite a bit. Well, can I keep these? That's crazy. Yes, you. you yes, you may. They're yours if you want them. Well, I'm just ecstatic and so happy to hear about this. Well, thank you so much, Mr. Justin and, and Kelly as well. Well, of course.
Well, that was just a whole lot of fun. Well, I want to thank Quetzal for the five gifted sub. Well, that is just crazy. Thank you so much for that. Wow, that is definitely going to help out the Mr. Blue and Mr. Orange show and the Mr. and all the Mr. Blue uh, ventures as well. Well, remember, if you guys want to send Mr. Blue a postcard and have Mr. Blue uh, say a bunch of wisdom, well, please do exclamation mark postcard and you can see all that kind of stuff. And also the exclamation mark Discord to joining the Luca Big Pants and Mr. Blue Discord. And also, if you guys didn't know this already, well, I guess it's time to tell you right now. You can also go and check out... You can also go in and check it out, LucaBigPants.com for all of the Mr. Blue merch? What the heck? Well, that is just crazy, you guys. You've seen this right now, LucaBigPants.com? Well, there's a Mr. Blue vintage tee, and there's also a Mr. Blue vintage crew neck. Well, this is crazy. Let's read what is on the shirt right now. Well, let's see. Oh, there's a weird, there's a weird bug. Weird glitch. Well, whatever. Anyway, the Mr. Blue shirt is saying, in the back of the shirt, it is saying, The Mr. Blue Show is brought to you by the Big Pants Media Company. The unauthorized reproduction or distribution of Mr. Blue's thoughts, ideas, advice, and infinite wisdom is illegal. For more information, please visit www.mrblue.show. And, well, look, it is signed by Mr. Blue himself down here in the corner. Well, I know you cannot see him very well, but the Mr. Blue Wisdom t-shirt and also the Mr. Blue Wisdom crew neck is available at lucabigpants.com. Well, isn't that crazy? Well, anyway... We're gonna get back to the game now and playing a little bit of Minecraft on the SDMP. All right. Well, William Worm, Mr. Fucking Bug, this has been a really fun time, and I've been enjoying getting a lot of the fan art from you guys. Well, well, isn't this just all fantastic time? Wow. Well, all this stuff is really quite great. It's me, Mr. Blue, and Mr. Orange. Well, I'm so sad Mr. Orange couldn't be with us today, but. This is just a fantastic time. Hey, Mr. Blue. I have made a fan art of Mr. Blue with William Worm using an ancient form called Microsoft Paint. I was wondering what you think. It's in the Luca Big Pants Discord. Well, I'll certainly check that out. Well, look, it's Mr. Blue. Well, let's go and check that out right now. There's a Mr. Blue and Mr. William Worm in the, in the MS Paint. Well, look at that. Is that a Mr. Blue? Well, that's crazy. And is that a Mr. William Worm? Wow, well, how awesome is that? And even... Look at that, that is a Mr. Blue propaganda. Well, we're trying to get as much blue propaganda as possible out into the world, so... Well, if you guys want to make a Mr. Blue propaganda and maybe some Mr. Blue stuff, well, please check it out right now today, and then... Well, please check it out right now. Wow. Well, all this stuff is pretty good. Whoa. That is Mr. Blue. And why is he looking at me like that? Okay. Well, anyway. William Worm. All right, everybody. Well, it's time to move on. And remember, exclamation mark Discord to join the Discord and... Checking out all that really cool merch and stuff, but let's read some new messages. Well, this mail is sent to us by Bardozilla, and this is what it says. Well, Mr. Blue, I need to have in your wisdom, because, well, my bones are not squishing like they were used to do. So, well, do you have any advice or wisdoms? Well, looks like you gotta maybe, maybe putting yourself in a big vat of boiling acid or boiling water to make your bones all soft again because it looks like you got your bones are, are too hard well remember if you're drinking too much fluoride it's going to calcify your pineal gland and if you're wanting to open your third eye that is not a good idea so all I'm gonna say is well maybe maybe if you're taking a hammer and you may be smashing your your legs and your arms maybe that'll and all your bones maybe that'll soften them up for you so well I hope that could help Let's go around and see if anybody wants to go on a little adventure. Well, it looks like the Mr. Blue influence is far and wide. 
I'm very happy to hear and seeing about this and stuff like that. Huh. I'm getting sick and tired of these vine. Not blue enough for me. It's me, Mr. Blue. Hello, Mr. Blue. Whoa, that is a very fast. Oh, how do I get out of here? Oh, th good. There's a ladder. Well, how are you, Mr. Blue? Well, I'm doing quite well. How are you, Mr. Justin? Well, I'm doing quite good, thanks. Uh, I gave Kelly this sword that I made for her, and now she's uh, zooming around with it very quickly and uh, running well, away from me every time I get close to her. Well, that is pretty crazy. Well, she's a bit unstoppable now with it. Well, I do like to see you having fun in the big blue ocean. It is fun watching her swim around. Very wholesome. Wow, and I'm liking that you having a little bit of blue on you as well. Thank you. Very blue. Yeah. Justin copied me. Well, you got a blue shirt too and it is looking quite blue and cool. Well, thank you. Ha! Huh. I really like blue. Well, so do I. I even have a blue pickaxe and a Whoa. blue bow. Well, that's quite blue, I'll tell you what. Well, blue is just my favorite color, personally. Well, that's crazy, because you'll never guess what. My favorite color is also blue. Well, I'm thinking that's quite quite a coincidence. Well, I'm thinking we should be friends. Well, I think we already are friends. Well, I like the sound of that. That's just great as well. Well, have you taken a look at Mog Island recently? Yes, uh, we just went by that earlier in the stream. Well, isn't that great? Well, I I, I really like the uh, the the mogging advice that's over there. I uh, I'm quite impressed. Well, thanks. Well, you're welcome. I I'm not very good at mogging, personally. Do you have any advice for someone that's not good at mogging, such as myself? Well, what you're going to want to do is definitely do an, a looks, looks maxing and also maybe you want to go to the TikTok Riz party or something like that. I don't, I don't know what that is really, but I hear that that might help you. Well, I'm thinking I'm going to thank you for the advice, Mr. Blue, with the diamond. Well, thank you so much. That'll go into the, the Mr. Blue Fund for Curing of Blue Disease. Thank you. Yes, I'm very happy to, uh, to, to help. You know how else you can cure blue disease? How? Well, Luca Big Pants has a website that is available that has a Mr. Blue shirt, and all of the proceeds to the shirt is going to cure blue disease. Yeah, can you believe that? The Mr. Blue merch. Well, looks like I'm going into the ocean. Well, isn't this better? Well, this is quite we nice. have a moment of silence. Ah. Well, I'm quite liking this quite a bit. Oh, look at that. It's Foolish Kia. Hello, Foolish Kia. Well, hello, Kia. <laughs> well, it looks like this guy can't handle the blue. He can't, no. He's not a true blue fan. Well, it appears as though there might be some discord among us. I love that game, Mr. Blue. What game? Among Us. No, I am saying that there is some currently some discord among us. Like, 
Perhaps there's an argument between the two of you and you're fighting each other with weapon. Oh, well, I'm drowning. Well, that was crazy. Did that sword just saving your life? It did. It, uh, it heals me. Wow, that is a crazy sword. I, I... Where did Kelly go? Well, Mr. Blue, if there's any advice I can ask you for, I would really... Oh, hold on. Uh, Foolish Kia seems to be afraid to uh, come close to me. Uh, she seems to be scared of me because I said I was chasing her earlier. She has a fear of being chased. So how can I make her not be afraid of me anymore? Uh, well, well, I would say that maybe stop. Maybe don't chase her. That's my advice. Mm. Thank you, Mr. Blue. A diamond. Well, thank you. Well, I'll try that. Okay, Kelly. I've decided I will not chase you anymore. You might have to stop crouching so that Kelly can hear you. Oh, yes. Hold on. My mouse died. Oh, dude. All right, Kelly. I've decided I will not chase you anymore. Okay. We will be friends. Yay. Thank you, Mr. Blue. Well, Mr. Blue, another case solved by Mr. Blue. Well, well, that is just awesome. Well, I'm glad that there's no longer any argument between you two and everything is chill, low-key. Well, do you mind if I give you another advice? Of course. Maybe getting a snorkel or maybe some sort of armor that makes you breathe underwater would be, would be chill, because... You seem to well, be taking I'm a lot of that drowning right now. Or you could also do your own thing. Hello, Justin. I'm Mr. Blue. Hello, Mr. Blue. I'm Justin. This is William Worm and Mr. Kelly. Fucking Bug. Well, hello, Kelly. Hello. It's me, Mr. Blue. Oh, God. Uh. Wait, did you leave? You just left Mr. Blue? Uh. Hello, Mr. Blue. Hello, Mr. Justin. How are you? Well, I'm good. I'm just floating around in the ocean right now. It's very green over here in this ocean. Not very blue. Well, you might be right. Well, I'm thinking I'm going to go over to my house now so that I can go get myself some real food. Uh, while I take a small break from uh, my my Twitch stream, I I I I, I find myself hungering for some dinner. <laughs> Did you fart? Someone fart? Someone farted? Who farted? Well, I'm not sure. Well, look, a little vial of blue. Yeah. I am feeling more blue than ever. Well, thank you so much. Hey, no problem. Like this is scaring me. <laughs> and then there were two. And one of them was blue. I like to doing rhymes. I'll rhyme on a dime. My name's Mr. Blue. 
And it's nice to meet you. You're Justin but lag. Now let's get that bag. I like this very much. Thank you, Mr. Blue. This is William Worm. He is not a germ. And this is Mr. Fucking Bug. He likes drinking coffee from a mug. My name is Mr. Blue. And I'm not taking a poo. When I do that, it's in the loo. Far away from you. Because of the that smell. It wouldn't be too well if Mr. Blue's poo were smelled around you. Well, I guess it's time for me to rest. In German they say, bis später, but I say, smell you later. Well, the game is frozen, but that is okay. Time to go home, maybe, and maybe hanging out at home and perhaps reading some of my postcards. If you guys want to send me a postcard, you can do that by doing exclamation mark postcard, and it should send you. A, it should send a little link to giving uh, five dollar for a postcard. Well, our little blue house is looking quite good right now, and I think it might be time for... Well... The secret Mr. Blue Lair. Mr. Blue, how long will you be streaming for? Well, to be honest, I think I'm going to be stopping the stream in maybe a little bit, but... For now, we're streaming and looking around and looking at all this stuff. And I want to thank JPEG Storm for the subscription with Prime. Well, thanks so much for that. Well, this is Mr. Blue's cave. The Mr. Cavern. Mr. Blue's Cave.
Well, I think this might be coming to the close of the end of the stream. We've been doing a lot of really fun things today, you guys, and I've been really happy and having a lot of fun as well with all of that. And, well, I'm just glad everybody's here and enjoying Mr. Blue and all that kind of stuff. Let's take a stroll around the town and see what is going on. I've been having such a great time with Mr. William Worm and also Mr. Fucking Bug. Mr. Blue, my beloved, can you please check picture gallery? Well, alright. Ah, Mr. Blue's Wisdom. Well, okay. I guess let's check the picture gallery and see what's up in the picture gallery. Well, what am I checking in the picture gallery, Alice and the Freak? Well, oh my freaking god, I'm seeing what you're trying to get me to see right now. Well, it looks like it is 100 gex. 100 gex, but it is Mr. Blue and Mr. Mr. Blue and Mr. Orange. Well, that's just freaking crazy, you guys. Holy crap, are you guys seeing this? Well, thanks for the great fan art. Well, look, it is the Mr. Blue trans flag. Well, that's just awesome. So much fun stuff that you guys are all doing in the art gallery, and I will definitely be using this for something. Well, this is just a great fan art. Well, guys, if you want to check out all the fan art and stuff like that, all you gotta do is join the ex is exclamation mark Discord and join the Discord. And, well, we got a lot of fun stuff going on right there, and it's gonna, gonna be a lot of fun. All right. Looks like Hunter is here. Let's go say hi to Hunter. He's a pretty cool guy. Hi, I'm Mr. Blue. Hi, Mr. Blue. What are you doing down here? Well, I just thought I'd... I, well, I just wanted to have a little sip of water from the fountain, and it looks like I slipped and fell once again. Oh, not again. Yeah, well, it looks like the sewers are coming along really nice and great. Yeah, I think they look pretty cool. I'm going to try to expand as much as I can without getting in the way of everyone else's building. Well, if you'd like to connect the sewers to Mr. Blue's abode, I would, sh I would be obliged. I would quite like that. For sure, I might make like a, a like a passageway, like a service tunnel or something. Well, that'd be quite great. I was actually gonna start building one or, uh, just a second ago. Straight down that way. I don't know what I'm gonna put down here yet. Kind of just have it closed off for now. Well, I quite like this. Quite nice. I haven't built out that way because I don't know how it's gonna look with the neighbors. You know what I mean? Well, absolutely. I couldn't agree more. Well, yeah. best of luck, and if ever you need someone to negotiate anything with, for example, if ever you need me to negotiate for your favor and helping you settle an agreement with somebody, a disgruntled resident that maybe your sewer is going to go through, well, please call me. I'm a great negotiator. All right. Thank you very much, Mr. Blue. Have you met my friend William Worm and also Mr. Fucking Bug? I've met million, million, million worm. I haven't met Mr. Bug. Well, that's Mr. Fucking Bug. Wow. Wow. It's very nice to meet them. Thank you for introducing me. Well, of course, it's my pleasure. Have you seen, have you seen this? Well, well, that is a shield that is saying the letter H, like maybe as in Hunter? Exactly. That's exactly it. Whoa. Well, that's just pretty crazy and radical. 
Thank you very much. All right, I'm going to get started on that service tunnel I was talking about. All right. All right. You have a good one, Mr. Blue. Thanks well, for visiting. Well, you as well, and thanks for the tour. Thank you. Well, I'm going to be honest with you guys right now. This looks pretty much exactly like my house, except that it's pink. Well, the interior is quite similar as well. Oh, well. I wonder if they are having the same passageway. Oh, no, they are not having the same evil passageway as me. Well, I guess that is making me special. Well, everybody, I think this is going to be the end of the stream. So I'm going to look at a couple of the letters that I've gotten and all the postcards that I've gotten today. And then we're going to end the stream and stuff. So maybe we're going to do a little bit of a raid, a little bit of a raid as well to somebody. Well, don't be so sad, everybody. This is just, this is just the end of a stream. I will definitely be back at some point. But right now... Right now, I really gotta do some other stuff, and do, I got some blue business, some blue business to attend to. So let's read some messages. Well, this message is sent to us by Yeeti, and they're saying, "Hello, Mr. Blue. Today is my birthday, and I am needing of some wisdoms. As I have grown one year older, I have noticings. I do not have W Riz. What do you suggest?" Well, thank you for the question, and, and I hope that uh, I hope that I can impart some some of my wisdom up upon you. Well, here's what I think. Maybe if you're becoming a guy that is a, the color of blue, that would really help in you in your favor. But also, just being yourself, and just be a nice guy and be yourself, and that should be pretty chill, and that should work pretty well in your favor as well. So, well, I'm really hoping that this could help you. And I'm hoping that you can be just a, that you can get some double your riz in the future. Well, this has been Mr. Blue's advice, and I think that, well, I think that that is pretty good advice as well. Well, hopefully that your quest for double your riz will be really soon figured out, Mr. Yeedy. Well, thank you so much for the postcard.
Well, what a beautiful and really fun stream that we're doing today. And well, I want to let everybody know real quick as well that if you guys are looking for some really cool... If you guys have a shirt that is no longer a good shirt and it looks like shit, and maybe your shirt is full of holes and stuff, well, not to worry, because you can get a new shirt at lukabigpants.com. L-U-K-A-B-I-G-P-A-N-T-S dot C-O-M as well. And, well... Looks like this is a Blue blue Wisdom t-shirt for Mr. Blue and all the proceeds go to the Mr. Blue show and also the fight to, for blue disease. The, fight, the fighting blue disease. Well, anyway, you can find that by doing an exclamation mark merch in the chat. And, yeah. Well, here's another fun little thing that you can do as well. If you guys are doing and if you guys are trying to do something real if you guys are trying to look at the, looking at the Mr. Blue content from the past like for example Mr. Blue's wisdom quickly well anyway I guess in the meantime let us talking about something really quick well you can check all of that out by doing exclamation mark vods exclamation mark v o d s and well you're going to get a lot uh, the channel with all of the vods but also if you go to look at big pants uh, Luca Big Pants YouTube, you can also find all the VODs in the live tab, but, well, anyway, that's all, that's all up to you. There's a bunch of Mr. Blue content as well that you can, you can, you can, that you can all take a look at, and, well, what a fun little fellow. I am sad to see him go. Well, Mr. Well, Blue is, Mr. Okay. Blue is available the next question. on YouTube to see the Mr. Blue show live. Bit of a couple of questions ago, somebody actually was torn limb from limb by a bunch of people that were, well, according to him, they were red. Well, I do not think that this is indicative of every single red person, but I think that, well, I do not know about this question. Well, I think that they are okay. The next question. Well, anyway, that is the whole Mr. Blue show, and you can find that at exclamation mark VODs, or by going to the Luca Big Pants YouTube channel. And remember, you can do exclamation mark merch for the, sh for the Mr. Blue merch. And you can also do an exclamation mark Discord to joining the Discord and having a really fun time on the Discord as well. And I think that's just about it. Well, thank you everybody for being a part of the stream and I want to thank everybody for being just a chill guy and, well, maybe being a blue guy as well. <laughs> well, alright. Well, let's see if we can't find somebody that is doing a streaming right now. Well, it looks like I'm under attack by a zombie. Well, I wonder what my f my good friends are up to. Maybe we should maybe we're rating in nothing but lag or perhaps we were trying to rate a foolish Kia oh looks like a foolish Kia is not even online well that's just too bad what well looking like we're gonna go to nothing but lag and giving him a little present of some of a raid. Hello. Oh, Mr. Blue. Hello. We, uh, I, I, I was, I was trying to go get Kelly before she got off, but she just left. Oh, there she is. I gotta go back to her place. Come on, Mr. Blue. Well, okay, I'll come with you. Okay, everybody, we're gonna get ready to raid Mr. Justin but lag. Uh, what? Well, I'm thinking she's playing a game of cat and mouse where as soon as I get close to her house, she leaves so I can't say goodnight to her. Oh, well, that is really unfortunate. Well, I'm really sad to hear about this. Well, I'm kind of used to it. She tends to troll me and clown on me quite often. Well, me and William Worm and Mr. Fucking Bug are really sad to hear this, but I hope that you can settle all of your difference and all that. And, well, maybe, maybe I have a gift that can help you with that. Well, what do you have in mind? 
Well, let me see. Let me give it to you right now. Well, guys, it is time to rating Justin, okay? Well, I hope you guys have a good stream, and let's go.